hope you guys are all keeping very, very well. We continue with our ATC course. And tonight, we're going to start putting what we learned into a little bit of practice. Uh, and we're taking a nice, calm, slow approach. There's no need to be rushing off and doing all the things. We're going to take a slow approach here. So we're on the ground at Shannon. And uh, <laughs> should be a bit of crack, right? Should be a bit of crack. Um, tonight, we're going to be working on stage four or up to stage four. So we have one, two, three, and four. That's what we're doing tonight. And just to explain myself a little bit better. Uh, sure, we'll chat about it, right? We'll chat about it. So, stage one. We need to obtain the ATIS information. That's right. Automatic terminal information service. We need to grab that. Get the local weather, right? And we're looking for the code. What information code are they going to give us? So that's going to be stage one. Stage two is going to be our initial call to air traffic control. We'll say who we are, what we are, where are we, what do we have, and what do we want, and when do we want it, right? Then we're going to request to start up the OWL engine and tell them what it is we want to do, right? Stage three is going to be requesting a taxi. And we don't mean, you know, taxi! We don't mean, no, not that fellow. We need permission to travel uh, from our parking position to the active runway. And we, we do so by using taxiways, right? And then finally, once we arrive at our destination prior to the runway, we call up the, uh, ATC and we say, hey man, we're here. And then they'll say, well done. Here's a gold star. And that's it. So points or stages one to four is what we're going to do tonight. It's going to require a bit of practice, a little bit of, you know, getting used to how things move. Spatial awareness and, you know, what's going on around you is critical to this because, well, I've no radar. <laughs> what? I've no radar at all. My radar's in my head and I'm using multiple cameras. But that doesn't help with the radar setup. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> we'll go over here, look. Ah, yes, that's better. It's a better sized ratio to screen. Uh, Murph to ratio screen, that is. Uh, so, yes. So, uh, there's a bit of reading. Only a little bit. We're going to recap on what we've done the first lesson, then the second lesson, which was last week, just in case anyone, you know, is new. Uh, and then we're going to go through tonight. Now, I'll do a full demonstration. So if anyone's unsure, well, you can have a look at what I'm doing for the first few minutes. As we find a bit of diddly idle here in the background. Yes, that'll work. So uh, I'll do a full kind of a run through. And I'll do the whole, uh, what I was doing the last time, uh, you know. Does my voice sound different like this? And it, it, for the immersion, you know. And uh, then we're going to see what happens. So depending on our numbers, how many people that we have tonight, well, we have some ATC channels up uh, on our Discord. And uh, I think Epic Fool will be around at some stage later on. He'll give us a dig out by controlling some of the other channels. So I need to show you this, lads, before we get going, right? So this is our Discord. It is, that's where we live, right? V virtually, that's our house. Uh, and in Discord, when you arrive at Discord, there's links all over the shop. When you arrive at Discord, you, you land in on this page. And it says arrivals, right? Uh, and from arrivals, you go to start here, right? You won't see all these other channels that all be grayed out. So you click on start here, have a read through our rules and guidelines, tell us what you had for breakfast, and you click on thy little shamrock down the bottom you see if you click on the shamrock well then the rest of the discord channels shall appear what you need to do you go all the way down until you find a heading called pilot ops pilot ops click in there once inside you can click on the pilot ops name and then a whole load of stuff will expand and i want to explain a little bit of this here this evening so have a little look at it right so in our pilot ops we have atc text that, you know, we can use that as text messages to each other and also just some bot commands that we can ask our avbot to go off and find us some information. For example, METAR, TAFs, and so on. The next one down is all about the ATC course. And this is everything that I've posted. Reference materials, manuals, books, and basically the whole kind of syllabus of what it is we're going to be working on. So everything's pinned. So when you get in there, just scroll upwards and you'll find out where everything is. All right. Now, there is an important document to download. It's down here in the bottom and it says virtual ATC ground school. Right. And when you grab that and download it, well, that is a portable digital file. 
Is that what they're called? Did I get it right? Do I win a prize? I think I do. Um, a PDF. Anyway, when you grab the PDF, it'll bring you to this document. And this document has been created with blood, sweat and tears of the efforts of everyone else on the internet. And uh, I've kind of jammed it all in together for one handy place. All right. Document, document, portable document file. So close. Uh, but anyway, what we have here, you have a contents page and all these uh, headings, they're linked. Right. So, for example, if you wanted to find a something, for instance, uh, oh, Jesus, what's a meter? Click on meter. Boom. There's a meter. And it gives you a whole load of information. All right. And you'll notice on the bottom left of every single page, whoosh, on the bottom left of every single page, there's a blue contents. Click on that and it brings you back up to the contents. I spent way too much time doing this, but I know how difficult and annoying it can be. Scroll up to page 20. I'll write it down. Ah, me wrist and all of this. Right. So what we're doing tonight, we're going to focus on lesson two. This is the practical part of the theory that we did last week. So to get us started, we have a chart here for Shandon Airport, Echo India, November, November, located on the west of Ireland. And this chart here, uh, it's from the AIP for Ireland and it shows Shannon Airport. And it's basically a map of where all the taxiways, buildings and aprons and parking positions and also where the runways are. So it's basically a map of the airport or the airfield, right? So we need to kind of spend a bit of time on this. Our instructions tonight, we're all going to work off the same script because I've typed a script of what to say and when to say it. We're going to be starting off over this side of the airport and it's near the light aircraft parking, also known as general aviation parking. That's where we're going to be starting from. So if you get in there and there's other planes, just like, you know, don't worry about it. Just give them a bit of space. Um, or, you know, just be anywhere over this region here. Get on the grass if you want it. It's totally fine. Our taxi route tonight is going to take us across the apron. Right? So see, east apron, central apron, west apron. They're just going to say taxi via the apron. Because right? this is the apron. The ramp. It's In ATC, it's known as the apron. And they're going to tell us to taxi onto Alpha. And how we know where Alpha is, well, because it's there. There's a big A, Alpha, Taxiway Alpha. And they'll tell us to hold short runway 06. 06 is down here, denoted by 06, meaning these numbers, if you've never known what they meant before, the runway numbers, well, the numbers relate to a heading. And it's based on a 360 degree heading compass thing, right? So, for example, what direction, if you were to say north, south, east or west, well, what direction would runway 18 be facing? Anyone now? There's a question, just to start us off. Would it be north? Would it be west? Repeat the question, will you? I didn't hear you. Sorry, sorry. So if your runway heading was runway 18, what direction is that runway facing? 18. Look at all the smart people in the class. South, because 18, or runway 18, refers to a heading of 180 degrees. Now, you don't have a runway zero. Yes, permission to land on runway zero. What? Sit down. No. You would have runway 36. If it was runway 36, where would you be headed for? Runway 36, or a heading of 360. What direction is 360? North. Very good. Very good. So we get the idea, right? Um, these airports, they can change. And this makes it very, very interesting. Over time, there is a change. Uh, the annual rate of change is what it's called. Because, well, it's all... I don't actually know. It's like the poles kind of shift every now and again. And magnetic north kind of moves. Or Anyway, it's not important. All you know is you need to make sure you have up-to-date charts. There have been a number of times you could be flying in the sim... And your chart will say, for example, runway 06, but you look out the window and in the sim it could say 05. Hmm. Or it could say 07. Hmm. What direction is it going to change? Right? So that's kind of, just be aware of that because they, they, they can change. Now, they won't change drastically. You're talking maybe a percentage of a degree over a year. And a lot of charts will tell you, this is telling you the annual rate of change is about 11 degrees west every year. 
right? Or 11 minutes of West every year, right? So it is interesting. It's called variation. There you go. Uh, so to move. Anyway, what we need to figure out here then is the apron, alpha, and the hold short. That's what we got to figure out tonight. So we have a script. So if we scroll down on this document, well, we explain what it is. And you can see that I've marked down stage one, stage two, stage three, and stage four. That's it. So we're going to talk you through it. Are we ready? And then I'll jump into the chat and say hello to everyone. So, stage one. We complete our pre-flight checks and turn on the battery and the radios. Using the inbuilt ATC inside of Microsoft Flight Simulator, we'll tune into Shannon Airport ATIS information on 130.955. Take note of the information letter, what the weather is doing, what the active runway is, and also the Q and H. Now the Q and H, that's your, that's the altimeter. We're in Europe, so we go by Q and H. Hey, Arch is here. Good to see you, Arch. I'll, I'll, I'll go to the chat now. Hang on, hang on. We're getting all terribly excited. So we make note of all these things and you need to write them. Oh, Jesus. You need to write them down in your little black book or on a bit of paper, right? Uh, now I'm going to be busy with the, with the paw pair and the peon. Uh, but do you know what I mean? you need to write this stuff down you need to write stuff down there's great apps you can use if you want to like draw on your tablets or whatever else but like you can't bait pen and paper right so you need to write the stuff down so stage two we're going to contact Shannon Ground we're going to tune our radio frequency into Shannon Ground now tune our radio frequency we have channels here on Discord right so we're going to use it from in there the details on this manual will change based on your call sign, the weather, everything. It'll change ever so slightly, but we'll get the kind of, we'll get the gist of it, right? We'll get the gist of it. So what we're going to be saying is, we'll call up and we'll say Shannon Ground, Echo India Tango Tango Mike. Now that's my call sign. That's Misha. It's Misha Looms, Aegis, right? I'm the Aegis. So my call sign is Echo India Tango Tango Mike. Mike. Shannon Ground will respond to this because they'll say, hey, there's someone calling. Echo India, Tango Tango Mike, Shannon Ground, pass your message. Ooh, pretty fancy. So they've addressed us by our call sign. They've identified who they are and they're telling us to pass our message. Fair enough. We'll then respond. We'll say, Echo India, Tango Tango Mike is a Cessna 172 at GA parking we have information bravo that might change request vo4 circuits and engine start right so what we're doing here we're saying who we are what we are it's important to tell the controller what type of aircraft you are it's just it's important uh your location ga parking or light aviation parking for this stick to the words on this don't worry if you make a mistake or you you know you put in your own words don't worry if you put in, come on, Muse, I'll get you now in a second. Uh, if you use your own words, don't let that throw you off. Don't worry about it too much. We're in a very kind of relaxed, safe environment. No one's going to shout at you. Well, I'll probably shout, but I just shout at everyone. I often shout at the wind, do you know? Um, but don't worry about making mistakes. So we tell them where we are, what information we have, and we're going to get that from the uh, ATIS, right? But also, sometimes the ATC will advise you information Charlie is now active, right? So you have to keep out, keep an ear out for ATC. We're then asking or requesting, we want via four circuits because we're using visual flight rules. The weather is good. We want to just fly around the airport. Circuit flying. Or uh, what's the other one? The traffic pattern uh, for our American brethren, right? And we also request an engine start. An engine start is quite unique uh, to... Specific airports, mainly in Europe, uh, a lot of airports won't require you for, uh, they won't require you to, you know, ask to start your engine. It depends on the airport, hence you read your charts, all right? Then, once we do all of that, ATC will buzz us back. Echo India, Tango Tango Mike, you are approved for VF4 circuits and engine start. Squawk, VF4, active runway is 06, Q&H, 1011, call for taxi. Jesus will say, now... But let's all calm it down and break it down. So ATC has addressed us by our call sign. And that's why it's important you pick a call sign that's familiar to you. You know what I mean? Like, 
I'm Murph. But if someone said, here, O'Driscoll, I wouldn't look around. Yeah. If someone says Murph, it doesn't matter who they are, you know, or any of you of my age, you know, if, if you're called dad, if anyone says dad, about 20 heads turn around. Oh, is that mine? Yeah, right. Do you know what I mean? So always pick something you are familiar with because you want to be able to pick it up easily if the background is full of chatter. All right. So. Echo India Tango Tango Mike, you are approved for VF4 circuits and engine start. Now you need to be careful of what ATC is telling us. They haven't said you are cleared for takeoff. They haven't said you are cleared for taxi. No, no, no. They're just telling us we are approved for VF4 circuits and an engine start. Squawk VF4, or they might say Squawk 7000. And again, that could be depending on the airport. It could be dependent on the region. For Shannon, it's this. So we stick with this. So if they say Squawk VF4, we're in Ireland. The squawk code for um, a VF4 is 7000. If you're in the United States, most of it is 1200. All right. Active runway is 06. Q and H 1011. Call for taxi. So they're telling us the active runway is 06. So, okay, it's runway 06. And the Q and H or the altimeter is 1011. Call for taxi. There's an instruction there. We need to call them when we're ready to taxi. So, we will we have to confirm all of this. We need to read back all instructions and we need to do it slowly, but clearly. So we'll say approved for VF4 circuits and engine start. Squawk VF4. Active runway is 06. QNH 1011. Echo India Tango Tango Mike. Now, you might say, Murph, why don't you say, you know, will call for taxi or will co? You can, but you don't need to. It's not very important. That instruction, you can't do anything until you have to call back the ATC. So he said, call me when you're ready for taxi. Okay, thanks. Roger, Roger. You don't need to. So we know we got to call him for taxi. All right. Next up is going to be stage three. Bit of background music. Stage three. Collect under... Uh, we're going to start up our engine, check our temperatures and pressures, and make sure the aircraft is good to go. When we're ready to start moving... We call up Shannon Ground once again and retransmit the following. Echo India, Tango Tango Mike, General Aviation Parking, ready to taxi. Nice. ATC will respond. Echo India, Tango Tango Mike, taxi via the apron and Alpha, hold short, runway 06. Now, this is where we need to be kind of prepared. Where are they going to actually send us to? Because we don't want to call them back up two seconds later and say, what? Where? Where is that? Who's in charge? Right? So we're going to be looking at our chart. And my advice is, on any airport, if you're going on to VATSIM or Pilot Edge or whatever, well, have a listen to what's going on first. You'll get an idea of what runways are active, what are the taxiways, and so on and so forth. So they're telling us, taxi via the apron to Alpha. Well, we can see Alpha up here in the corner. Look, taxiway Alpha. And then it says, hold short. Come back to me. Come back to me. Oh, is it hot? Where's my other chart gone? Oh, it's up here. It's up here, look. Hold short, runway 06. Here is the hold short line for 06. So that's the instruction. So we now know where, where it is we need to go. We now know what we're doing and where we're doing it. So we're happy enough. You'd write that down as well, right? And the advanced, the, the advanced part of this, even though this states an IFR checklist, uh, this is a digital document, right? One that I created uh, and, and I, was, I was selling them, right? Uh, well, for this course, these are free. If you put in exclamation point checklist, you'll get this for free, okay? And even though it's for IFR, you can, of course, use it for VFR as well. So you'll see you can fill out this. Your departure ATIS, what's the information code? What's the winds, the visibility, sky conditions, so on and so forth. The active runways, right? All your frequencies for your airport go up here, including the ATIS, clearance, ground or tower. Uh, you don't necessarily need this part, but you can absolutely fill it in if you want. So you could say we are cleared for circuits, our route, well, they're circuits. Altitude, if, there's in, if there is any limits, because ATC will usually give you some sort of a limit or limitation. Uh, frequency, again, you're going to have them over here. Your transponder, Squawk VF4, that'll go in over there, right? So exclamation point checklist will get you this. Here's the one. See the lovely teal colour? Taxi to runway. Ah, okay. Via, and then it says cross or hold short. 
So we're going to taxi to runway 06 via the apron and alpha. Hold short, runway 06. And if you look at the makeup of Shannon, we're not actually crossing any other runways. It doesn't say cross runway 22 or whatever. So that's, you write down your taxi instruction on this. Now you can print these out. You can, you know, they're double sided. So if you print, I think if you print, if you print one page, you should get two of these checklists on one page. And then if you like put your paper back into your printer or if it's a double sided printer, you have four check sheets on a page. And when you, you know, fold it in half, you have a little booklet. All right. Really handy. Colonel Fork, wished, will you? They're exactly like them. They're exactly like them. I'm he these are heavily inspired, by the way, by Josh Flowers from Aviation 101. But they make total sense. Now, these have been kind of, you know, I've designed these to, to work in a flight sim. Um, but, you know, he would use this stuff, uh, uh, you know, in the real world, right? But yes, you can, if you wanted to, you can print off millions of them. Just don't tell poor little Greta. She'd be going friggin' nuts. You know what I mean? Uh, filing with TTM. Epic fool, good to see you, man. You're very welcome aboard. Um, so you can use these sheets if you want to. Anyway, they're for free. Grab them now, exclamation point, checklist, and away you go. All right? So back into our little booklet of the thing, which is, Jesus, where did I hide it? Here it is. Uh, so zoom down here. Yes, yes, yes. So we'll do our startup. And uh, we're going to be told taxi via the apron and alpha, hold short runway 06. Stage four, with our instruction noted, we check out our charts and we start our taxi to the runway. In this case, we have to taxi via the apron, then alpha, and hold short runway 06. And I have included a couple of helpful notes before we get going. Make sure your beacon, nav, and taxi lights, make sure they're turned on. Check for other aircraft and people before moving off. Look around the plane. Am I going to crash into anyone? No, I'm going to be grand. Start the initial roll and then test the aircraft's brakes. That's shocking important. Even as a flight simmer, if you have pedals on the ground, right, and they're suddenly disconnected and you have to hold short and suddenly you can't because the USB did the doo -doo -doo, right? Ah, and you're going, disaster. Nothing to see here, lads. There's nothing to see here. So test your friggin' brakes. Keep an eye out for all other traffic. Traffic, traffic. Maintain a safe distance. Just give people a wide berth. We don't want to see overtaken. We don't want to see people smashing through other people. Take your time because you absolutely cannot do any sort of messing like that when you're on a VATSIM network. This is a different type of flying, right? So it's not your call to tell other people what to do or, you know what I mean, push them around or creep up on them. They're under the instruction of ATC. ATC are going to monitor. If someone's acting the ginnet, right, or if someone's stopped or whatever, well, they can disconnect them from the network if they need to. Otherwise, they're telling them what to do. So when you see other aircraft, just give them plenty of space. All right. Your taxiing speed should be about kind of, you know, four knots, give or take four to six knots. It depends slightly faster than a, a very brisk walk or like a jog, not a jog, but a jog. Right. And then, of course, don't forget your run up checks before getting up to the whole short line. Some airports will indicate where the run up areas are. It's essentially where you do your pre-takeoff checks, you test your mags, you know, you make sure uh, the engine settings are okay, so on and so forth. Once we arrive at the whole short for runway 06, we'll contact ground to confirm our position. We're now there. So we'll say Echo India Tango Tango Mike, holding short runway 06 at Alpha. Echo India Tango Tango Mike, contact tower on 118.7. Over to tower on 118.7, Echo India Tango Tango Mike. Once that's done, that's it. That's the end of this lesson. So we're doing four stages, right? As soon as you guys get to the whole short mark at the runway, which is going to be over here, I'll show you here now briefly, right? So just to give you an idea here in the simulator, now not everyone has this exact scenery, but the layout is the same. I'm using the MK uh, Studios Shannon, but you don't need it, right? The one in the sim is fine. You're going to taxi across the aprons. That's, here's the aprons look. So we're going to taxi across this way. And then we're going to ramble up onto Alpha. And this taxiway here is Alpha. It should have a taxi marker on it. There should be a little signpost to say what it is. You're looking for the thing that says... The Alpha, right? Where I recommend to do a run-up is around here. 
or indeed around here. You don't want to stop on the middle of the taxiway. But again, for this lesson, do not pass other aircraft. Give them a bit of time. If, if it means that, you know, if you, were, if you were trying to get ahead and you do your run up here and then you belt on and then some other fella is doing a run up in here, well, don't pass them. Just don't be that guy. Stay behind them. Maintain your position. All right. Once you get up then to the whole short line, which is noted by the whole short line, which is that. You stay on that side of it. Don't go on the runway side. Go on that side of it. That's when you're going to call up ATC and say, holding short, runway 06 at alpha. At that stage, the controller is going to hand you over to a tower frequency. What I want you to do, and this is important, once you get that hand over to tower, I want you to hit either escape, yeah, or slew your aircraft out of there. Just imshi yell it. You can take off if you want and blast off. That's entirely up to you, but you won't have ATC service. The instruction here is contact tower. Once you're gone from here, and ideally what I want you to do, just hit the escape key. All right. What I want you to do, as soon as you disappear, the next aircraft queuing up will see the space and then they report. Okay. We could go and try and say, you know, we've eight aircraft lined up and I can say, well, you're number one, you're number two, you're number... We're not going into that. It's only when you get up to this whole short line. And you'll have to bear with me, lads. There's no radar here. And we're doing this to facilitate not only the entry-level pilots, but, of course, our Xbox pilots. So we have no way of physically seeing you on radar. I have to go by, you know, these things that are hidden behind those things. Do you know what I mean? So... You're not actually holding short until you're up at that line and you wait until another aircraft has gotten out of the way. They've disappeared or, you know, they've gone off yaki booing down the runway. That's entirely up to them. So that's the gist of what we're doing tonight. We're going to take our time. You can try it multiple times. That's entirely up to you. It's all about getting the confidence of speaking, listening, you know, decoding or working with the information you're getting and being able to follow the instruction and carry it out whilst maintaining control of your airplane. That's all we're doing tonight. So don't worry if you make mistakes, if you get things wrong, if things go up in an absolute ball of smoke, it'll be grand, right? Absolutely grand. Nothing to worry about whatsoever in the slightest things at all. Yeah, right? Yeah, right. Right, lads, I think now we're all caught up. So what's going to happen here? I'm going to give you a full rundown uh, of what this procedure is from start to finish. You're going to see it in the flesh and see what it is I'm going to do. Then it's going to be your turn to jump in. And we have a number of um, ATC channels up and running. Now, here's the thing. It's going to be impossible to have 20, 30, 40, or even however many on one server. So what I will ask, have a look. Murphy's just standing under a red face colour. Yeah, yeah, exactly, right? He doesn't go red in the face. <laughs> if I never go red in the face. Um, whoop. Anyway, this is important. Pay attention. Shh. Quiet. You there. Down the back. Move to the front. Right. This is important. Um, you'll notice that we have an ATC lounge. Everyone jump into the ATC lounge. That's just, You can talk amongst yourselves. You can test to make sure you're... Um, microphone and your headphones and all that jazz are working and you can jump in there and you know tell Gibbo he's brilliant right red in the face red in the hair all the same <sighs> I'll come up with a word that'll properly describe right it starts with ba and it ends with star anyway uh, so jump into the ATC lounge what we're going to do I, I ideally I'd like five or six people uh, on each server if we can, let's go with two servers and you'll see the instructions here. In the voice channels, we have a Shannon ground, a Shannon tower, denoted by a, and that's for the Southeast Asian server. You'll see the instructions here. Okay. B is for Shannon ground and Shannon tower on the West USA server. So ideally, Let's see, can we get some people onto the A channel and some people or people onto the B channel? I'm going to stick in the A channel. Epic Fool, uh, who said he'd give us a dig out here tonight. Uh, if you can jump into the B channel and just sit tight for the moment. Wait till we go through 
uh, the full demonstration and then I'll jump in and we can do a bit of controlling as well. One thing I will ask, if you can help me out tonight, do please read your call sign slowly and clearly. I struggled last week I, or two weeks ago. I was like a big Egypt. I was like a complete and utter big Egypt. Who? November what? Uniform Romeo Mike Alf. <sighs> Right, so just if you can, because I'm slow, and uh, well, that'll be a huge help for me, so it would. So, you need to do two things. Number one, get this booklet document thing with all the instructions. We'll get it somewhere handy. You're going to need it. And put it somewhere handy. You're going to need it. Okay? So, let me see. Now, is it better there or better there? Hmm. It's better over here, look. I'll put it over here on this screen. Okay? So, have a now listen, and this is what's going to happen. So, stage one. Should I have sounds? We do. Stage one is going to be obtaining the ATC. So, we're going to start off... We're going to start off with a uh, getting the aircraft ready to go, and then we're going to tune in and grab the ATIS. So, quick. We can follow our checklist with the Cessna. For this, I'm just going to do the basics. Park and brake is on. Fuel shutoff valve is in. Mixture is out. Throttle is out. All our lights are off, circuit breakers are out, flaps are up, uh, and that looks good to me. So we're going to turn on the battery. And we need to turn on our avionics briefly, because I need to turn on the radios. So we'll let the units warm up and do the thing. Epic Fool said no. Now what are you going to do? <laughs> Brilliant. And at the same time, ah, balls, right? <laughs> uh, you will get that in a signed code to squawk once a controller. Yeah, a controller will give, usually give you the code, yeah? But just, just have a watch here what I'm doing. I haven't started up the plane. I haven't done anything. I'm just putting some battery power in. And I want to get my radios turned on because I need to do some listening, Okay. Now, I've set manually the weather for today. I set it up manually, so don't worry too much about it. But the information you're going to hear is because I have I've I've custom weather, right? So, let's see. We're going to tune in 130955. 130.955. Why are we calling it niner? Because 9 sounds like 5 over the radio. And if you go back through the manual or the document, you'll see the phonetic alphabet. 130.955 or 9055. Shannon Airport Information Hotel 0800 Zulu. Wind 063 at 5. Visibility 9. -er. Sky condition 4,800 feet scattered, 13,800 feet scattered. Temperature 1 tree. Dew point 1 tree. Altimeter 29.85. ILS runway 06 in use. Landing and departing runway 24. VFR aircraft say direction of flight. All aircraft read back hold short instructions. Advise controller on initial contact UF hotel. Okay, hotel. Right? Shannon Airport Information India 0800 Zulu. Wind 063 at 5. Visibility 9. -er. Sky condition, 4,800 feet scattered, 13,800 feet scattered. Temperature, one tree. It's just changed. Two point, one tree. Altimeter, two niner decimal, eight five. ILS runway, zero six, in use. Landing and departing runway, two four. VFR aircraft, say direction of flight. All aircraft, read back, hold short instructions. Advice controller on initial contact, you have India. So they've changed it. Usually it changes every hour. Usually every 55 minutes they update the ATIS information. So I listened in at 0854. It was Information Hotel. It immediately changed to Information India. So Information India is current. Now there's a glitch there with the sim because it's saying that the active runway is 06 but departure is runway 24. They forget that. Runway 06. The controller will tell us anyway we just need to make sure that we have the ATIS information code. It is now turned to India. So information India is current. Okay. And the active runway is six. Don't mind the sim. The sim is drunk. Runway six. Right. Okay. We have obtained all of that. Now it's time for us to talk to air traffic control. 
Right? So we'll start. And this is what we say. Shannon Ground, Echo India, Tango, Tango, Mike. Echo India, Tango, Tango, Mike. Shannon Ground, pass your message. Echo India, Tango, Tango, Mike is a Cessna 172 at General Aviation Parking. Information India, request via four circuits and engine start. Echo India, Tango, Tango, Mike, you are approved for via four circuits and engine start. Squawk via four. Active runway is 06. Q and H 1011. Call for taxi. Approved for via four circuits and engine start. Squawk via four. Active runway is 06. Q and H 1011. Echo India. Tango Tango Mike. That's stage one and stage two complete. We're halfway there. Next up, we have approval to start our engine. So Beacon Light comes on. Uh, nav lights can come on for the crack. We put our mixture to rich. Open the throttle. Fuel pump. Fuel is moving. Pump off. Have a look around the aircraft. Clear prop. And we've started up our engine. Nice. The controller sounds just like me. He's my cousin. His name is... Gorf. So we start up our engine, we check our temperatures and pressures, and then when we're ready to taxi, we're going to call back up the controller again. So we're just going to make sure that all our bits and bobs are up to date. Now, when you get the altimeter or the Q and H, well, that's when you go to your uh, altimeter. And that's where you want to put in your altimeter setting. So 1011 is what you gave us. 1011 is roughly there, yeah? And if you're unsure, you can zoom in. If you only have uh, inches of mercury over here, you can go into your sim settings and change it. If it's a, if you're on like a G1000, it should show both, but you can jump in, right? You can jump in. And then you can see it there, all right? Okay, so that's set up. Uh, let me see now. Transponder was set to standby because he told us we need to squawk VF4. 7,000 is what we want. And we don't need that with our autopilot or any of that jazz. So we're good. I'm now ready to taxi. So we are expecting uh, the apron and alpha. Because that's what he told us. Yeah. So we're over here. Look. We're on the ground here. We're going to taxi via the apron and alpha. That's what we reckon they're going to tell us. But we'll wait until we're told. All right. Now, where's this? Move this across. Pretty good. Put this in. And we continue on. So it's now time to talk to the tower. Echo India, Tango Tango, Mike, a general aviation parking, ready to taxi. Echo India, Tango Tango, Mike, taxi via the apron and alpha and hold short runway 06. Taxi via the apron and alpha and hold short runway 06. Echo India, Tango Tango, Mike. We've just received our taxi instruction. We have to taxi via the apron and alpha and hold short runway 06 we are now allowed taxi so we got to get our aircraft ready to go right taxi light comes on our beacon is on and our uh, nav lights are on that's all we need for the moment all right so remember we're gonna put some power in don't run over person small bit of power there's rollage Test your brakes. Brakes are working. Brakes are working. Okay, good stuff. And all this while, I'm checking out for other aircraft. Make sure I'm not going to get in their way or collide with them or break things and so on and so forth. Yeah. It's going to lean my mixture here as we taxi. Because again, you need to keep in control of your aircraft. You don't want to foul the plugs because a high fuel mixture um, on the ground at low revs, you're going to foul the plugs. You're going to put too much fuel on them. So, I had a look at my chart. I know where the apron is. It's signposted all over the shop, but we know this is the apron. So we're just taking our time. And again, it's it's the speed. It's slightly faster than walking. It's, it's, it's kind of like a brisk walk. It's almost like a jog, that sort of speed, right? Now, 
Uh, oh, good man, Gibbo. If anyone isn't getting anything after tuning into the ATIS, make sure that you have the ATC voices turned on under the assistance options in the sim. So if you've turned in your radios and you can't hear anything, go into your assistance options, uh, go down to user experience and make sure you have uh, ATC voices turned on. Okay, then you'll hear them. I hear voices. Thanks, Gibbo. Fair play to you. Now, can anyone remember what information for the ATIS we have to work off? Any ideas? So we're taxiing across. All is looking well. And you'd be monitoring, you know, you're getting your aircraft kind of pretty much ready to go. So you're monitoring your temperatures and pressures. Um, you know, you'd be going through your kind of your takeoff briefing, you know, if aborted takeoff, all this sort of jazz. Who's Jog Murph? My pace jog or yours? <laughs> yours, yours. This would be a sprint for me. An absolute sprint for me. So again, as you taxi, you're watching out for other aircraft. If there's a slower moving aircraft in front of you on the taxiway, stay behind them. Match their speed. Keep your distance. All right? Don't worry too much about the people behind you. It's what's ahead of you. That's what matters. Good man, Colonel Fork. Top of the class. Hey, like the program is here. Good to see you. Uh, Quaggy says how to adjust the volume on Discord. Right click the username. It'll come up with a little volume bar and you can do the thing. So we're now on Alpha, and we want to do a run-up. So what I'm going to do here, uh, I'm just going to move over a little bit here on the left-hand side. Just to do a run-up. Now, bearing in mind, there's going to be other aircraft starting to move behind me, but that's okay. I, I need to do my run-up. Ideally, you want to point the nose of the aircraft into the wind when you do a run-up. But we won't get bogged down on whose direction or what. So I'm just going to do something handy like this. Kind of get it into the wind. Something like that. Park and brake comes on. We're going to put our mixture to rich. And then a run of check in the Cessna. We're going to bring our RPM up to about 1750. Roughly there, right? And what we do now, we need to do what's called a mag check. So we go down here to our mags. And we're going to test them. So we're going to test the left mags. And we're expecting a drop of about 150 RPM. There's the drop. Go back to both. Go for the right mag. There's the drop. Go back to both. Fuel pump on. Throttle to idle. Make sure it doesn't cut out. Fuel pump off. And power back to about 1,000. Engine fouling on most default aircraft doesn't exist in the sim, but you would hear, you can actually tell if one of the mags is running rough. You'll hear this, bah, 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 right? And a way to clear it, you kind of just reduce your mixture level, increase the RPM, and that'll just burn off the carbon. That's more advanced stuff, and uh, we'll, we'll figure that one out, right? If you need to silence the ATIS, just change frequency. So if you're using the 530, just click the button. And if you're still hearing ATC on a different frequency, just change the frequency. Give it something unique. So fire does fix everyone. The slick one, yes, yes it does. <laughs> so we've done a road up and we're going to taxi up to the hold short of runway 06. That was our instruction. That hasn't changed. Notice I haven't done anything with landing lights or flaps. I haven't done any of that stuff yet. I'm just taxiing. So we're approaching the whole short. We're going to stop before the whole short. We are now in position. Park and brake on. Relax the body. Now it's time to talk to ATC. Echo India Tango Tango Mike holding short runway 06 at Alpha. Echo India Tango Tango Mike contact tower on 118.7. Bye bye. Over to tower on 118.7, Echo India, Tango, Tango, Mike. And thus completes or concludes the lesson. Are we happy enough? 
Do you think you can give it a shot, lads? Do you think it's going to work out well for you? Do you feel pumped and everything? Yes, we can do it, Murphy. Give it an old bash. Right? Jesus, Low Tech has subscribed. God almighty. Nine months, man. Thank you very, very much indeed. Cheers. What are we calling it, Low Tech? It's, it's nine months? We should call it Mini Low Tech. Ah. Right. And that's it. That's what we're doing. Take your time. There's no rush here. Be clear and be, you know, committed to what you're saying. If you make a mistake, don't worry. Hello there. Hello there. Hello there. Welcome in. Who's this? Mr. Marco. Good to see you. If you make a mistake, don't worry about it. It's fine. That's why we're doing these on our time. Um, and once you get to this stage and they hand you over to tower, just hit the escape button. That's all, because then you'll disappear and then the airplane behind you will say, hey, my space, grand, I can move up and now I can do the thing. All right? So I'm just going to kind of vamanos somewhere handy out of the way because what I need to do here, lads, I need to set myself up in such a way I'm not in your way. Yeah? So let me see. Park and brake, yes. As soon as you jump on the radio channels on Discord, you wait Give it a few seconds and make sure no one else is talking. Okay? Read the script and you're, you know, be 100% certain that uh, you understand your call sign and it's familiar with you. All right? So, lads, let's see what happens. So I'm going to jump into the Alpha channel. Epic Fool is on the Bravo channel. Oh, good man, Epic. You're also streaming it, you f legend. Right, so let's see. No, I think this will work. Uh, station announcement. Hang on, we'll do the voice. Hang on, lads, say nothing. Station announcement. Uh, Shannon Ground is now active on... 121... Decimal 8. Brilliant, right? So we're going to see if someone... Is someone going to call us up? That's what we need to do, right? All taxi fees are 50% off. So someone will jump and start talking and we're going to write down their information. All right. If that makes sense. Need to get on with stuff ready, lads. So the first thing folks are doing, they jump on. How are we for the audio visual? Everything, everything working okay, lads, yeah? They're going to jump on and they're going to have a listen to the ATIS. Information India is current, but I'll update them if uh, if I need to update them, okay? So I can advise them just to say Information India is now current or active, right? So after a few minutes, someone should jump on to the ATC and they'll request. So they're just going to jump on, they're going to give me their call sign and then I'm going to talk back to them. And I'm going to simulate the role of a controller. Epic Fool is doing the same over on the Bravo channel. So I have one, two, three, four. I have four pilots with me. Epic Fool has three pilots with him. Don't worry about jumping on straight away. Have a listen first. Get a feel for it. Uh, and then maybe give it a shot, right? It looks like you're muted in Discord. I am muted, Dust uh, Duster. That's okay. I'll unmute myself when I need to speak on Discord. Because I've no push to talk set up. Because I'm an Egypt. But if I have push to talk, well then... Well, should you imagine the crack? Me thumb would be absolutely jaded. Because I need a live hot mic. Hot mic! I need a hot mic for the stream. All right? So it should be grand. But I'll know when someone's talking. Don't worry. I should know when someone's talking. We hope. You know the clicky pens? Are you, are you, do you remember Goldeneye? Boris! Remember your man Boris? And he'd be giving an absolute socks flicking the pen and... Do you remember that old Goldeneye, James? But anyway, um, I used to do that in work. Until my boss one day unscrewed the top of my pen, removed the spring and put the pen back down in my desk. And then I tried to click it and it wouldn't click. I was like, oh, Jesus, I get the message. Tough crowd. <laughs> but yes. Now, we should be good. We should be good. We've got a good few people in. Now it is the waiting game. But remember, it's all about taking your time. 
get the ADIS information, then you're going to call up ATC. You're going to call up the ground frequency. You're going to start off by saying Shannon ground and then your call sign. I am invincible. That's your man. Yeah. Brilliant. I trust Murph found another pen. You better believe it. I came in the next day with two of them. Double action pens. Bananas. Right? Iceman did the same with the pen and Top Gun. Yeah, yeah. Aries. I used to think I looked a bit like Iceman. Uh, is this using High's flight events frequency? No, Cold Nebo. Not yet. We'll look at that maybe a little bit later on. I don't think we need to. I think once we're kind of comfortable and we're up and running, we'll keep Discord as our Xbox pilot ATC client. And then the rest of us will eventually transition onto VATSIM. I mean, that's our mission. We're going to end up on VATSIM. Uh, and we'll be doing this for real in the sim. You know what I mean? We get the idea, right? So you can just manually switch it in Discord. Just drop in on a channel. That's all you need to do. Uh, I used to date a girl who was a pen chewer to one exploding in her, her mouth in English class. Oh, Jesus. What colour was it? The ink. My battery is dead, says Daedalus. Just do a restart. Uh, of the go into your main menu, click restart. Shannon Grown, Shannon Grown's come check. Uh, reading you five, Shannon Grown. See you. It works. So we're just having to wait for anyone who's on the Shannon Grown frequency. Uh, when they're ready, they'll call us up. And you'll see other controllers. They could be sitting for a while before people call them up, and then all of a sudden, boom. Lots, lots and lots of activity. Uh, and then nothing. So don't be worrying. Take the first step. It's only me you're talking to. You're not going to get it wrong. Jesus, I get everything wrong. Do you know what I mean? You be grand. Just go handy with your call sign. I need to write it down. Slowly. Right? <laughs> it was a blue pen, was it? Jesus. She was a blonde, so we called her Smurfits. <laughs> Yeah, no pressure hunted yet. No, no Sol. Uh, I think my best was 90 minutes at Echo Golf November X-Ray and getting one aircraft. There you go. There you go. It can take time. And like, if you watch, they like to say Arch, uh, Arch streams when he controls. Jamie does the same London controller. I said, what? And they're bopping away, listening to music or they're having the chat. I couldn't do that at all. Brutal. But no. Too much going on in me head. Speaking of which, do you like me haircut? Yeah, that's right. Hang on. I'll make it look even prettier. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. Wait for this. Look. 3D of me haircut. Oh, look. I can press that button. Hello there. Hello there. Hello there. I didn't know I could do that. Look. Oh, wait. I'm out of breaking now. Oh, look at that. Jeez, that's very fancy, isn't it? Right. Anyway, back to this screen. So uh, let's see what happens. Squad, somebody give, give us a call. 1850-715-815. Just... Okay, don't call that number. Echo in the uh, mic. Did anyone get the last bit of his call sign? Echo India something mic. Didn't get it. Didn't get it, but sure, we'll try it again. Shannon Ground, Echo India Charlie Papa Mike. Nice. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, pass your message. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, Cessna 172 in GA parking, information golf, request VR4 circuits and engine start. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, you are approved for VR4 circuits and engine start. Squawk VR4, active runway is 06, QH 1011 and call for taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000. Uh, active runway is 06. QNH 1011. Echo India. Charlie Papa Mike. That was perfect. We're getting there, lads. We're getting there. This is exciting. I almost dropped my pen twice and everything. Now, how do I keep a track of this? Oh, yeah. I have to write stuff down, lads. <laughs> Anyone who does controlling, like, ATC in the sim, they'd be like, you're such an idiot, Murph. We'll get there, we'll get there. 
So there's our first aircraft. Uh, now, we're saying information Gulf, so I didn't correct him to say it's India, but I'll, I'll do this now. Watch this. And you'll actually hear something like this. All stations, this is Shannon Ground. Information India is now current. There we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's cool, it's cool. Don't forget the latest ATIS is India. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Looks like I picked the wrong week to quit drinking. Do we have to hop in this in the Cessna or can we use a different GA plane? You can use a different GA plane. Ideally, I'm going with the Cessna because everyone has a Cessna. Shannon Ground, Golf, India, Bravo, Bravo, Oscar. Look at that for the call sign. Golf, India, Bravo, Bravo, Oscar, Shannon Ground, last message. Golf, India, Bravo, Bravo, Oscar, Cessna 172 at GA parking. Information, India. Request via four circuits on engine start. Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar, you are approved for via four circuits and engine start. Squawk via four. Active runway is zero six. Q and H one zero one one. Call for taxi. Approved for via four circuits and engine start. Squawk seven thousand. Active runway is zero six. Q and H one zero one one. Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar. Man, Gibbo, you nailed it. Brilliant. Good man, Gibbo. That was good, wasn't it? There was a fella now who just knew what he was going to say. He was committed, lads. Committed. Spot on. Absolutely spot on. So how about that weather, huh? Tumbleweed. <laughs> Epic food, how are you getting on? Gibbon needs to do some voice impressions. Yeah, right? Golf, India. Bravo, Bravo, Oscar. Uh, Cessna, 172. Uh, right? He has it down to a fine art. But if anyone just... Even if you're not in the sim and you want to try out this, jump on. Just, you know, try and keep track of what you're doing. But, you know, we'll, we'll try and do the thing. So don't be afraid to jump on. Just don't be afraid. It's only us. Don't mind everything else. It's only us. The angry Scott might come on. <laughs> Brilliant. Uh, Shannon Ground. Uh, I'm down here and the parking is absolutely crap. <laughs> I want a taxi to get out of here. Quick. I've information. Your face. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> That'll be brilliant. <sighs> I should have set up some sort of a pen paper setup a bit better. I'm sure, listen, we'll get there. So as a controller, I have two aircraft... Uh, that I know are going to call Cannon me when Ground, they're... November 812, Charlie. November 812, Charlie. Shannon Ground, last message. November 812, Charlie. GA parking information, India. Request VFR circuit and engine start. November 812, Charlie, you are approved for VF4 circuits and engine start. Squawk VF4. Active runway is 06. QNH 1011. Call for taxi. Approved for VF5 circuit, engine start, squawk 7000. Squawk VF4, active runway 06. QNH one zero one one November eight one two Charlie. Perfect. That's a great attempt. Brilliant attempt. The only thing missing, has anyone copped? What was the one tiny, teeny, tiny bit of information missing from that entire transmission? That was really good though. It was clear, it was precise. Don't worry about jumbling the words. That's absolutely fine. I was well able to understand that pilot. Squawk was okay. Memphis done got it. It was just the aircraft type. Remember, who are you? What are you? Shannon Ground, Echo India, Tango Tango Mike. Echo India, Tango Tango Mike. Shannon Ground, pass your message. 
Echo India Tango Tango Mike C one seven two G A Park and Information in India uh, request VFR circuits and engine start. Echo India Tango Tango Mike, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk seven thousand. Active runway is zero six. Q and H one zero one one. Call for taxi. Pray for VFR circuits and engine start squawk 7000 squawk VFR active runway is 06 QNH 1011 echo India Tango Tango Mike great attempt that's brilliant lads this is brilliant Soul Sniper Games of course you can join of course anyone can jump in here it's all about learning things together lads and don't worry that's my call sign but that's totally fine just if, if there's someone else, I might tell you, use a slightly different one. Because when I call Echo India Tango Tango Mike, I can't have two or three pilots answer back. You know what I mean? That's why we try and keep it all on its own. But this is great. This is brilliant. Echo India Charlie Papa Mike, GA parking ready to taxi. Echo India Charlie Papa Mike. Taxi V, the apron, and Alpha, and hold short, runway 06. Taxi V, the apron, Alpha, hold short, 06. Echoing the chariots, Papa Mike. Perfect. <laughs> Charlie Foxtrot. Whiskey Tango Foxtrot. I love that, Ailerons. I love it. <laughs> okay, so we got one, two, three. We got four aircraft active so far uh, on this channel, right? I think Epic Fool has a few on his as well. What server and what airport? Uh, so we're at Shannon Echo India, November, November. All right. And uh, the server doesn't matter too much. You can go either Southeast Asia or you can go on the... Uh, was it East USA? So here is Echo India Charlie Papa Mike, also known as Six Knots, and he's now on the taxiway. He's taxiing. So ATC on the ground, they tend to be looking, they'll have a vantage point. They're looking at the ground uh, areas. You know, they can visually see it. That's what they do, right? So they can clearly see. If there was other moving traffic, they could advise them. But Six Knots is the only one that has uh, permission to start his taxi. All right. So we can see there he is. He's now gone off to do his thing. And I'm expecting Six Knots to call me back once he lands up over there before the runway. So he's doing his thing. And again, it's all about taking your time. Shining ground. Golf India. Bravo, bravo, Oscar. So hot right now. Golf India, Bravo, Bravo, Oscar, Shannon Ground, pass your message. Golf India, Bravo, Bravo, Oscar, GA parking, ready to taxi. Golf India, Bravo, Bravo, Oscar, taxi via the apron and alpha and hold short, runway 06. Taxi via the apron, alpha and hold short, runway 06. Golf India, Bravo, Bravo, Oscar. Perfect. And again, you'll listen, right? Don't worry if you get uh, slightly sidetracked with what you're saying. Don't worry if you're not following this in its exact detail. It's it's. Gibbo gave me a call. He didn't say he was ready to taxi. He just he just gave me a call. He's like, "Hey, ground," and I was like, "Yeah, pass your message." And then he said, "I'm now ready to taxi." Ah, okay, cool. Okay, here's your taxi instruction. Don't worry about these things. The point of the matter is. Shining ground, Gulf Alpha, my Costco November. Golf Alpha Mike Oscar November, Shannon Ground, pass message. Golf Alpha Mike Oscar November, Cessna 172, GA Parkin, Information India, request VFR circuits and engine start. Golf Alpha Mike Oscar November, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway is 06, QH 1011, call for taxi. 
Golf Alpha Mike Oscar November, the Pro VFR Circuits and Engine Start, Squawk 7000, Active 106, QNH 1011, Golf Alpha Mike Oscar November. Really good effort. That was awesome. Guys, this is really, really good. I, like, this is really good. There's November 812 Charlie, GA parking, ready to taxi. November 812 Charlie, taxi via the apron and alpha and hold short runway 06. Taxi VA, the apron, A and hold short runway. November 812 Charlie. Okay, so there was two slight bits there. What we had, uh, the callback A, you don't need to say A, we need to keep it with the phonetic alphabet. And the reason why you don't say A, well, A sounds like, you know, hey or J or K, you know what I mean? So we say alpha, all right? Uh, and the second thing then, the active runway, in Europe, we say 06, not just 6. If you're in the United States, they would say taxi runway 6. We have to say 06. But don't worry about it too much. It's still very clear. We have control of it. I know what's happening. You guys know what's happening. And more importantly, the pilots who are now doing this, well, they know what's happening. That's what it's all about, right? So we can see now six knots. He's up there. He just completed his um, run-up check. And a lot of the time, you'll find ATC might call you just before you get to the hold short. They might say... I could I could say to you, six knots, now contact ground or contact tower. They, they might preempt you because they're watching. It depends if they're busy or if they're not busy. So they're, they're keeping an eye on you. But if they're not, you know you got to report back. All right? Shannon Ground, Sierra Echo, Golf, Tango, Foxtrot. Sierra Echo Golf, Tango Foxtrot, Shannon Ground, pass your message. Sierra Echo Golf, Tango Foxtrot, this is a Cessna 172 at the GA parking, information India, request VFR circuits and engine start. Sierra Echo Golf, Tango Foxtrot, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR, active runway is 06. QNH 1011, call for taxi. Sierra Echo Golf Tango Foxtrot is approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR, active runway is 06, QNH 1011. Perfect. Just a call sign at the end, but we know it's him. Echo India Charlie Papa Mike is holding short of 06 at Alpha. India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, contact tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. Contact tower on 118.7. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike. Perfect. Six knots has nailed it. And that's six knots. That's, that's, he's now completed all four stages and you can do it again if you want but that's it he's done it now if he wants he can take off he can do whatever he likes this is where you know tonight November 731 November Echo ah uh, I'm about to drop me book last aircraft calling Shannon Ground please repeat call sign November 731 November Echo November 731, November Echo, Shannon Ground, pass your message. November 731, November Echo is a paper warrior with Information India. Request VFR circuits and engine start. November 731, November Echo, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway is 06, QNH 1011, call for taxi. Squawk 7000, tax, uh, 
taxi runway 06 of uh, QNH 1011, uh, 731 November Echo. Okay. Now, we didn't do, it didn't do bad. I still got a read back that was understood. I, I could understand. Golf Alpha Mike Oscar November. Geo Park and ready to taxi. Golf Alpha Mike Oscar November. Taxi V the apron and Alpha. All short runway 06. Taxi via the apron and hold short room with 06 Golf Alpha Mike Oscar November. Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar holding short runway 06 at Alpha. Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar contact tower on 118.7. Bye bye. Over to tower on 118.7. Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar. Bye bye. Yeah. Brilliant. Echo India Tango Tango Mike G. I park and ready to taxi. Echo India Tango Tango Mike. Taxi via the apron and Alpha. Hold short runway 06. Taxi via the apron and Alpha and hold short one by zero six echo in the Tango Tango mic. So just to jump back. So just to jump back. <laughs> just to jump. <laughs> just to jump back to uh, Cold Nebo. So don't worry if you mess it up. In fact, you're helping me. If you make a mistake, that's good because we we can all we can all see. We can all see what's happening, right? Um, see you later. I think you have a hot mic. Oh, behave. But not you're transmitting. I can hear myself. And that's a terrible, terrible thing to hear. Ah! Um, but anyway. Wait for it. Wait for it. So, Cold Nebo. Just, if you read, just, just focus on the script part. Because um, I think what happened there, you moved away from the script. And you were you were trying to focus on what I was saying more so than reading the script. For the moment, just focus Shannon on that Brown, script. Shannon Brown, Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey, Sierra, Romeo. Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey, Sierra, Romeo, Shannon Ground, pass message. Shannon Ground, uh, Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey, Sierra, Romeo is a Cessna 172 at GA parking with information India. Request VFR circus and engine start. Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey, Sierra, Romeo. You are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR. Active runway is 06. Q and H, 1011. Call for taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawking 7000. Active runway is 06. Q and H. 1013, Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey, Sierra, Romeo. And Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey, Sierra, Romeo, QNH 1011. Correction, QNH 1020, Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey, Sierra, Romeo. Okay, we could harp on. Don't worry about it now. Don't worry about making a mistake. If you read back something incorrectly, now I know the same Shadow ground, golf, delta, delta, bravo, bravo. Last aircraft calling, this is Shannon Ground. Please repeat call sign. Golf, delta, delta, bravo, bravo. Golf Delta yeah. Delta Bravo Bravo Shannon Ground pass message. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo radio check one two one decimal eight. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo readability five. Readability five also Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo. That's quite okay as well. Jump on, do a radio check. It's not needed for every flight, but if in doubt, you can you can do a radio check. There's no problem. If the controller is very busy, uh, you know, you, you might put them under pressure, but, you know. Sierra Echo, Golf Taco Foxtrot, GA Parking, ready to taxi. Sierra Echo, Golf Tango Foxtrot, 
Taxi via the apron and Alpha and hold short runway 06. Taxi via the apron, Alpha and hold short 06, Sierra Echo Golf Tango Foxtrot. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. Practice for Vatsa. November 812, Charlie. Holding short of runway 06. November 812, Charlie. Contact tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. So what we're waiting is for that call sign just to repeat that instruction. So they'll just say over the tower on 118.7. That's what we're looking for. So we'll see what happens. If they don't answer, we can always call them back. November. November 812, Charlie, Shannon Ground, contact tower on 118.7. November 81, Charlie, contacting tower on 118.7. Perfect. Perfect. Bit of a curveball thrown in at the end, but that's okay. He managed to completely save the whole thing and say, yeah, I'm going to talk to Tower on 118.7. And again, don't worry too much about trying Channel to... ground, Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, pass message. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, Cessna 172 at GA Parking. Information India. Request VFR circuits and engine start. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo. You are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR. Active runway is 06. Q and H 1011. Call for taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR. Active runway is 06, QNH1011, Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo. Cool. Nice. But yeah, don't worry too much. As I said, read through that script line by line by line and keep doing it. it, it it's like muscle memory. You know what I mean? It's going to get your, your head in gear to say, ah, that's the sort of vocabulary they want to hear. You know what I mean? I remember doing you know, close order foot drills years ago. And like, you know, taking you a stage further in your foot drill, I am now going to show you the command for at ease. The Irish word of command being chassis arosh. Huh? That's what you're supposed to say. It was called a screed. It's actually called a screed, right? But when lads had to learn it, they had to turn around and say, Taking Echo you India Tango Tango Mike holding short runway 06 at Alpha. Echo India, Tango Tango Mike, contact tower on 118.7. Bye bye. Over to tower on 118.07. Echo India, Tango Tango Mike. And Echo India, Tango Tango Mike, small correction, tower on 118.7. Over to tower on 118.7. Inc. Echo India Tango Tango Mike. Bye bye. Brilliant. Now sometimes you'll hear a bye bye or a see ya. Right? It depends on the tower. You can add all these things in, right? But don't worry about it. Uh, for which network are you training for? Uh, Philipson, we're, we're eventually it's going to be VATSIM, maybe Pilot Edge as well. This is heavily focused on Irish airspace, so there's going to be differences, you know? But don't worry about the differences. Anyway, when it came to the, the screed, instead of saying taking you a stage Alpha for Mike Oscar November, holding short runway zero six at Alpha. Golf Alpha Mike Oscar November, contact Shannon Tower on one one eight decimal seven. 
over the tower on 118.7, Golf Alpha Mike Oscar November. Perfect. One, two, three, four, complete. Shin and Ground, Zulu, Sierra, India, Charlie, Echo. Zulu, Sierra, India, Charlie, Echo, Shin and Ground, pass message. Zulu, Sierra, India, Charlie, Echo, Cessna 172. Uh, J parking information India requests VR VFR circuits in engine start. And Zulu Sierra India Charlie Echo, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000. Active runway 06. QNH 1011. Call for taxi. Approved for VFR circuits in engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway 6, QNH uh, 101011. He has it. He read it back correctly. He just got a little bit stuck on the uh, on the call sign. But he got it absolutely right. That was perfect. This is really, really good. Guys, I'm so proud of you. It all sounds like they're doing a great job. Oh, epic. They really Charlie are. Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey Sierra Romeo. GA parking, ready to taxi. Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey Sierra Romeo, taxi via the apron. And Alpha, hold short, runway 06. Taxi via the apron. Uh, a... Uh, um, taxiway Alpha and hold short runway 06 Charlie Foxtrot Whiskey Sierra Romeo perfect don't worry if you make a mistake start again or say say what you're going to say the controller might correct you they might sound angry they're not angry they're just going to sound more clear and more precise and perhaps add a bit more volume behind their voice if you're constantly making mistakes, sure, you might frustrate a controller at a busy airport. But that's why they have events on VATSIM, like the Wings events, right? Like what we're doing here. If you make a mistake, don't worry. It's grand, lads. This is really, really good. I did not think... I did Golf, not think Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. GA parking, ready to taxi. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Taxi via the apron and Alpha, hold short, runway 06. Taxi via the apron, Alpha, and hold short of runway 06. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Sweet. Look, I didn't think you guys would be up this, this far. Jesus, this is great. JM Knight says, it's really cool to watch. Dude, it's great to see so many people. Sierra Echo Golf Tango Foxtrot holding short runway 06 at Alpha. Sierra Echo Golf Tango Foxtrot, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. Over to Tower on 118.7. Sierra Echo Golf Tango Foxtrot. Bye. See you. <laughs> brilliant. Right? Absolutely brilliant. What is it? It's lads, these are absolutely crushing it. As Gibbo says, you're not crushing it. Golf 249 Tango Mike. Golf 249 or Tango Mike. Shannon, ground, pass message. Golf 249 Tango Mike. Cessna 172. GA parking. Information India. Request VFR circuits and engine start. Golf 249 Tango Mike, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR, active runway 06, QNH 1011, call for taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR, 
active runway is 06, QNH 101, Golf 249 Tango Mike. Hello there. And Golf 249 Tango Mike, just to confirm, QNH 1011. He left out a one. It's grand. Uh, Golf 249 Tango Mike, QNH 1011. Perfect. Well done. And here's the important thing. Here's the trick of the trade. Call back. It's all about calling back the instruction. It needs to be correct. If it's not correct, don't worry, you'll make a mistake. But the important thing here is you read back the instructions. If you're unsure, say again, slowly, or whatever it needs to be, right? Tell them, say again. But the whole point here is don't worry too much. Don't get ground of number six nine or four seven echo. I know that voice. November six nine or four seven echo Shannon ground pass message. November six nine or seven echo is PA twenty eight Piper Warrior at West Parking Information India requesting VFR circuits and engine start. November 69047 Echo, you are approved for VO4 circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000. Active runway is 06. QNH 1011. Call for taxi. Approved for VO4 circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR. Active runway is 06. QNH 1011. November 69047 Echo. Brilliant stuff, Colonel Fork. That was deadly, wasn't it? Uh, Colt Nebo, no worries, man. Don't tell them slowly, though. They won't like that. No, but like, you know what I mean? They'll know the crack. If you ask ATC to repeat something, they will slow down because you're telling them, I dropped my book. Well, you're not telling them that. Jesus. Sulu Sierra, India, Charlie Echo, J Parking, ready for taxi. Zulu Sierra, India, Charlie Echo, taxi via the apron, and Alpha, hold short. Runway 06. Taxi via the apron. A. And whole shot of runway 6. Sulu Sierra, India, Charlie Echo. So just remember, that's all perfect. Just remember, don't go by the letter. The letter has to go back into the phonetic alphabet. So if it's A, it's Alpha. If it's B, it's Bravo. C, it's Charlie and so on and so on. We, we don't use the actual letter, taxiway A. It's taxiway alpha, all right? Just to keep that on board. Uh, Aileron says, one thing I will say, if you get picked up or miss something in a message, oh, respond correction. 249 Tango Mike. GA parking ready to taxi. Golf 249 Tango Mike. Taxi via the apron and Alpha, hold short runway 06. Taxi via the apron, Alpha and hold at, uh, hold short runway 06, Golf 249, Tango Mike. Perfect. Uh, if you get picked up or miss something in a message, respond correction. Uh, and what the correction is. So in this case, correction Q and H one zero one one. Yeah. So if you say one zero one, oh, I'm after making a mistake. November six nine or four seven Echo West Parking ready to taxi. November six nine or four seven Echo taxi via Alpha hold short runway zero six. Taxi via Alpha hold short runway zero six. November six nine or four seven Echo. Very good, isn't he? That's a man who knows what he's doing. Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey Sierra Romeo, holding short runway 06 at Alpha. Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey Sierra Romeo, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. Over the tower on 118.70, uh, Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey Sierra Romeo, thanks. And Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey Sierra Romeo, correction, Shannon Tower 118.7. And just say, ah, 118.7. It, you know what I mean? It's If you read something back incorrectly, just be aware. ATC Standing will call you. Hotel Kilo 2-3. Uh, Hotel Kilo 2-3, Shannon Ground, pass message. 
Hotel Kilo 23 in a Cessna 172 at GA Parking Information India requesting VFR circuits and engine start. Hotel Kilo 23, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR, active runway 06, Q&H 1011, call for taxi. Hotel Kilo is uh, Hotel Kilo 23 is approved for VFR circuits engine start. Squawk VFR or 7000, active runway 806, Q&H 101011. And that's okay. That's okay. Golf Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, holding short, runway 06 at Alpha. Golf Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. Over to Tower on 118.7, Golf Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Good day. Brilliant. Lads, I'm so proud of you. Honest to Jesus, I'm so proud of you. We have so many people doing this. This is incredible. Like, it really is. Do you know what I mean? There's other people, and I'm sure if you fly in the network, you're going to be like, hey, this is easy. Sure it is. But Jesus, remember when you first started off. You know what I mean? I remember it. It was terrifying. You guys are absolutely, like... Oh, behave. Oh, behave. You're doing brilliant. Look at that for timing. <laughs> no, no, six, nine, four, seven, echo, holding short runway zero six at Alpha. November, six, nine, four, seven, echo. Over to tower or contact tower, one, one, eight, decimal seven. Bye-bye. Over to tower, one, one, eight, decimal seven. November, six, nine, four, seven, echo. Thanks. See ya. <laughs> brilliant. Uh, I sat at Echo Golf Charlie Charlie for at least half an hour before making my first radio call. Oh, absolutely. Uh, say, Mr. Egan, thank you very much for the bits, man. Cheers. I appreciate it. Is it necessary for GA to request end and start in Europe or more specifically in the UK? It depends on the airport. Can I start again for practice? Absolutely. You want to try this again? Let's do it again. No worries at all, lads. No worries at all. I'm only controlling up until the whole short point. We don't have tower up and running yet. Next week is when it gets a little bit tricky. That's when we start flying, right? And it'll be one circuit. It won't be three. It'll be one circuit. And then the crack will start. But for now, <laughs> man, DGS, up the yard. Uh, DCS says, if your plane doesn't understand Q and H... Do you have to convert it in your head or can you ask ATC? Well, if you're in the sim, it'll read it for you. If you're on a glass display... In ground, this is Hotel Kilo 23 at GA Parking Ready to Taxi. Hotel Kilo 23, taxi via the apron and Alpha, hold short, runway 06. Taxi via the apron, hold uh, via Alpha, hold short, runway 06, uh, Hotel Kilo 23. Perfect. Um, lots of talking. You must need a sip. Yeah, so basically, you usually get it with clearance, yeah. But if, if you're unsure, like in your sim, you can set it to metric and you'll see the Q and H. Or failing that, like a quick Google and you can you can convert millibars or, you know, inches of, what's it? Inches of mercury back into uh, hectopascals. But most aircraft will show you, there'll be a dual display. So you can set it up in both ways. If you're flying in Europe, Q and H is... The thing. Q and H is what we use over this side of the world. Uh, and then um, altimeter is what you guys use over that side of the world. You know what I mean? Are we doing all right so far, lads? Go oh, 249 Tango Mike. Holding short runway 06 at Helper. And Golf 249 Tango Mike. Contact tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. Over to Tara on 118.7, Golf 249 Tango Mike. Goodbye. Great stuff. This is brilliant. Lads, I can't get over how brilliant this is doing. Absolutely fantastic. 
And we also get QFE at some European airfields. You can Memphis them. So Q and H is what we're going for. Um, and the reason why I'm going with Q and H um, is the pressure measured at the station, then reduced down to mean sea level. Shannon, ground, golf, delta, delta, bravo, bravo. Golf, delta, delta, bravo, bravo, Shannon Tower or Shannon Ground? Pass message. Golf, delta, delta, bravo, bravo, Cessna 172 at GA parking, information India. Request VFR circuits and engine start. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. You are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR, active runway 06, QNH 1011. Call for taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR, active runway is 06, QNH 1011. Golf Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Perfect. Ailerons, it depends on the airport. It's not, you're not 100% certain you get QFE. Probably a lot of the time you will. But it, Q and H is, is over here. Q and H uh, will be more popular. It's basically the altitude over the airfield. So, for example, if you're saying this airport elevation is, what, 40 feet, if that? So, this, the pattern altitude or the circuit altitude is 1,000. Therefore, you want to be at 1,040 feet. That's how they do it. Uh, Man Arcade says, top job, everyone. Absolutely, man. This is... Br I can't get over how good you guys are doing. It's it's really, really good. These are deadly. A moment to be proud of. You know what I mean? So uh, next week, there'll be a, a bit more kind of a jiggery-pokery. As I said, we're going to get airborne, fly around, and then land. Don't worry. It'll be grand. We'll be starting off on a queuing system at Alpha, holding short of runway 06. You got to take off clearance, you do your manoeuvre, and away we go again. Hello there. Hello there. Coder Dozer, welcome in. Many thanks for the follow, dude. Many thanks. Don't get me started on the lack of EU standards. Oh, yeah. Golf, Delta, Hello Delta, there. Bravo, Bravo, GA parking, ready to taxi. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, taxi via the apron, and Alpha, hold short, runway 06. Taxi via the apron, Alpha, and hold short to runway 06, Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Good stuff. Uh, who's this? Collison. You're very welcome in, Collison. Uh, no, this is... <laughs> I see, give one a Concord. This is... Uh, it's for Xbox Shannon as well. Tower, Golf, India, Bravo, Bravo, Oscar. Golf, India, Bravo, Bravo, Oscar. Shannon Ground, pass message. Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar is type Concord on the West Apron. And uh, we're just fierce, thirsty here. Request catering trucks. Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar. Roger, catering trucks dispatched. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. Man, give out, you legend. <laughs> He's in a Concord. Oh, come here, hang on. And uh, Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar. Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar, go ahead. Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar, does the jacks work on that? No, the flush is broken. <laughs> Send medics. Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar. Medics dispatched. Golf India Bravo Bravo Oscar. Contact Shannon. <laughs> Control. <laughs> on. Something. <laughs> You're not allowed to do that. That's brilliant. <laughs> oh, for God's sake. <laughs> oh. Pan, pan, pan. No flush in the jags. Pan, pan, pan. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Right, we're doing well. We're doing well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Epic, how many did you have? We have fourteen. Fourteen on our sides with David Bay going a second time. Fifteen. Lads, this is incredible. I was thinking maybe five or six. You know what I mean? Just to, yeah, yeah, we'll give it an old blast. You're really, really doing well here. 
Chin and ground, Hotel Kilo 23, holding short, runway 06 at Alpha. Hotel Kilo 23, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye bye. Contacting Tower at 118.7. Thank you. Really well done, lads. Like, really well done. Blue ice warning. <laughs> Right, do you know what we must do? We must jump into Epic Fall. November 6, 9, or 4, 7, Echo. November 6, 9, or 4, 7, Echo. Shannon Ground, pass message. Shannon Ground, November 6, 9, or 4, 7, Echo. Looking for taxi to West Parking. November 6, 9, or 4, 7, Echo. Taxi via Charlie. Delta 2. Delta 1, turn left onto GA parking. Taxi Charlie, Delta 2, Delta 1, GA parking for November 6947 Echo. And uh, 6947 Echo, sorry, did you request parking for the West Apron? Uh, that's A firm. Asher, ah, sure, listen, uh, November 6947 Echo, taxi via Charlie, Delta 2, Delta 1, the Apron, and Alpha. To the west apron. Taxi via Charlie, Delta 2, Delta 1, the apron, and Alpha, November 6947. Curveball completed! Well done, Colonel Fork. So what Colonel Fork is doing, we're going to do a little bit of that next week. But you kind of get the gist of it, right? He's at the far end of the airport. Zulu, Syria, India, Charlie Echo, holding shot of runway 6. At the Alpha. Zulu Sierra, India Charlie Echo, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Over to Tower on 118.7, Zulu Sierra, India Charlie Echo. Thanks for the ATC. Sweet. Cool, right? Cool. I have multiple buttons, lads. I've Shannon pressed... Ground, Charlie Foxtra. Whiskey Sierra Romeo requesting radio check. Charlie Foxhorn, Whiskey Sierra Romeo, Shannon Ground, readability 5. Readability 5, Charlie Foxtrot, Whiskey Sierra Romeo, thank you. Hey, two cats is here, good to see you. I have to press three buttons. I have a button here, I have a button over there with the mouse, and then I have to write. Ah, oh, Jesus. I could do it with an extra pair of hands. In fact, I need six of them. How is Epic Fool getting on? I want to jump over to Epic to have a listen. Give me a break as well. Ooh um. Okay, so hang on. We'll do with this. Uh. Oh no, we'll sit tight now here for a minute. Who this? Durka Durka is here, dude. How are you, man? Jesus, two months. Thank you very, very much indeed. Durka, are you going to um Flight Sim Expo by any chance? Do you know what I mean? A few beers, like. Thank you very, very much indeed, man. I almost took off the wrong direction. Having tower would have been easy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, runway 06. You know what I mean? Golf Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Holding short runway 06 at Alpha. Golf Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Contact Shannon Tower on 118.6. Correction. 118.7. Bye-bye. Over to Tower on 118.7, Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Good day. Jesus, I made a mistake there, lads. Not like me. Ah, no worries at all, Durka. Hope you're keeping well, dude. Uh, 118.6, easy to spot the dub. I know, right? Go pay with that. 118.6, contact the Tower. Ah, right? <laughs> Don't park on Taxiway Alpha. The lads from Finglas will nick your wheels. <laughs> Is there whiskey in that tea? I don't know. Epic food, how are you getting on? What we're going to do, actually. Actually, do you know what we're going to do? I'm going to take a break just for like two or three minutes because I want to jump over to Epic Fool uh, because he's on the Bravo channel for Shannon on a different uh, network, okay? And uh, how's this going to work? What did we say the Bravo was? 
because I, I I'm going to change over. So Bravo is going to be on the West USA server. Okay. So one second now. All stations, this is Shannon Ground. Five minute break. I will report back in five minutes. Like a controller would do that. Hold position. Press start. I mean, pause. That just wouldn't happen. A controller might disappear for a few minutes, but they won't leave you stuck. They just won't leave you stuck. All right. I could say monitor Unicom, and but we're not, we're not, we're not there yet, lads. We're not there yet. All right. Uh, now, servers. What do we say it was? It's going to be the West USA. West USA. Okay. So give it a few seconds to see what happens. I'm going to jump into Epic Fools channel. We'll have a listen. Yeah, the apron alpha hold short zero six. Nice. Thanks so for the listen. apron alpha hold short zero six delta echo call from the fox sort. So there's quite a few people here. You can see them. So you can see where Epic is. He's put himself down in a, pos in a position there, right? So we'll kind of move around the airport. So we have, uh, we've we've ran Bog Mord over there. Epic is in a position so he can just slew and keep an eye on everyone. And we've got a couple of people parked up here. We have Meowchi, Martel, Filthy, and Kazaki are parked up there as well. And this is the idea, right? If you're on the Xbox, there, it, there's currently no way for this to work with any sort of online ATC. What we're doing here with Discord is the only way, right? So if you're on the Xbox and you ever want to experience, you know, some sort of ATC, well, this is how we do it. At least for now, until Sierra something better Echo, comes. Golf Tango Foxtrot holding short of runway 06 for a power taxi down to Charlie. Sierra Echo, Golf Tango Fox, Roger over to Tower 118 Decimal 7. See ya. Over to Tower on 118 Decimal 7. Bye bye. Now, you might say to yourself, what in the name of Jesus is that? A, t a powered taxi to Charlie? What what does that mean? We'll learn all about these things. But does anyone in the chat, do you have an idea? What does he mean by a powered taxi down to Charlie? Give it a go. See what you think it is. He's requested a powered taxi from runway 6 down to Charlie. Any ideas? Shannon Ground, November Papa Charlie, nine or one. November Papa Charlie, nine one, Shannon Ground, pass message. November Papa Charlie, nine one, is a Cessna 310 at the uh, GA parking with information India. Uh, request VFR circuits and engine start. Remember, Papa Charlie 9 1, you're approved for V4 circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway 06, QH 1011, call for taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawking VFR 7000, active runway is 06, QH 1011. November, Papa Charlie 9 1. Read back correct. Sweet. So there's different kind of things you'll hear. Read back correct. If there's, a, you know, if there's a difficult instruction or if there's many elements to an instruction, something like a long taxi, you have to taxi here, there and everywhere. When you repeat it, a controller might say read back correct. Now, it's not to be confused with like a clearance or any of that. They're just telling you you're correct. You have the right information and we'll learn a little bit more next week. So we'll just have a listen here now for a second. Uh, Shannon Ground, Echo India, Tango Tango Mike. Echo India, Tango Tango Mike, Shannon Ground, pass message. Echo India, Tango Tango Mike, we have uh, uh, just a question. Uh, power Taxi, can you explain? Echo India, Tango Tango Mike, sure. Power Taxi would be where you are using a runway for a fast taxi where you don't intend on taking off. Thank you for the clarification. Echo India Tango Tango Mike. And Echo India Tango Tango Mike, um, somebody from Ops will be out to you shortly for, um, I think you have some unpaid landing fees. That money was only resting in my account. Echo India Barely, because we Mike. haven't got it. <laughs> oh, brilliant. That's brilliant. Epic Fool, he's doing a great job there. He's doing a great job. All right, I'll jump back into Alpha. 
All stations, Shannon Ground is now active. Cool. Shannon Ground, we have a number for you to call. <laughs> Usually it goes the other way around. So I, I heard a joke the other day. This is to everyone listening in on the on the radio as well, right? I heard, it, or, or maybe I read the joke the other day. So someone called up. They said something funny. Uh, hang on, I need to find it. It makes more sense. Bear with me, lads. Was it in the memes? It's in the meme channel, right? Head on into the meme channel or the meme jokes. This was absolutely golden, right? This was said, right? Uh, where is it now? This is actually said. Listen to this. Uh, so, from an unknown aircraft waiting in a very long takeoff queue, a pilot was heard saying, I'm bored. ATC jumps on and says, Last aircraft transmitting, identify yourself immediately. Right? And the pilot said, I said I was bored, not stupid. <laughs> I thought it was brilliant. Anyway, uh, that's, 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 that's the lesson for uh, this week's homework. Now, where was it? It was over here, look. Uh, yes, yes. It's very good, wasn't it? Stop broadcasting Shannon Crown. Sorry, Rad. Sorry, Rad. I thought it was very good. I knew I was on the ATC voice. It was all to give you the, the immersion, lads. The immersion. Oh, wait, look, I'm on the wrong... Ah, oh, Jesus. Southeast Asia. Back there now, Murph. Back there now. <laughs> thought it was golden. That joke works better in text, to be fair. Yeah, thanks, Muse. Yeah, Murph, you basically butchered it. You made the joke unfunny. You made a funny joke unfunny. Well done, Murph. Yeah, thanks, Muse. Yeah. Very kind of you. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Now, how are we getting on? Am I in the right... Am I in the right channel? I am. I'm in the right channel. Thank God for that. I laughed. I just didn't use the airways. <laughs> Everything's fine. Airlock, yes. You just have to go into the memes channel and look at some of the messages. They're brilliant. Everything's fine. Ah! Don't worry. You wouldn't understand. <laughs> I was sticking up for you, Jesus. I won't... Oh, no, wait, Muse. I'll come back. You're deadly crack. Don't mind them at all. That was Muse trying to help me out, saying, yeah, it was funnier in text, but more if well done. Sorry, Muse. Ah, Jesus. I always said it though, yeah, great fella, Muse. Great fella. 100% that lad. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Instant unsub by Muse fan. Instant. Marv, I thought you were grand and then I realised you weren't. <laughs> oh, dear. Right, how are we getting on? Is there anyone else here on Shannon Ground frequencies that want to try and do a thing? Uh, there are some pure gold ATC comms out there. Do you remember the lighthouse? Was it the lighthouse? 21 Gregory, give it a shot, man. Two years of tier three finished. Slams door on way out. Uh, it's on Discord, Gregory. It's on Discord. Uh, Kennedy Steve is always worth a listen. Oh, yeah. US Destroyer versus a lighthouse. That's the one. Brilliant. Cessna X, your mode C is trans is intermittently reporting 3,000 feet. Say your altitude, pilot. Cessna X is intermittently at 3,000. Is it West USA? You can go Southeast Asia, I agree. <laughs> Some of them jokes are brilliant, man. They're fantastic. Lads, you're doing really, really well tonight. And it's this is a challenge, considering we've gone from, you know, pressing the button to say, hello there, you know, contacting ATC, to you guys actually requesting to do a something, reading back the information, doing a taxi, and then reporting at your whole shore for the runway. This is really, really good. Keep working on that. Keep repeating this. And it's all available here in our little manual, right? Which is available over on our Discord. So if you read the script, we're going from stage one to four. And then next week, it's going to be five, six, seven 
And then the week after, it's going to be probably a combination of the whole thing start to finish, right? So this week, stage one to four. Shannon Ground, Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, Shannon Ground, pass message. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo is a Hawk T1, GA parking, information, India, request VFR circuits and engine start. And Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk, 7000, active runway is 06, QNH, 1011, offer taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway is 06, QNH 1011, Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo. Nice. Now, you might be doing well to get a Hawk to do circuits. Yeah, could, right? You're under pressure because, like, you'd have a circuit done in about six seconds. But yeah, you could do it. I uh, won't be listening back to this, my voice and nerves. David Bay, don't worry at all. That's the whole point of this. It's only us, lads. At the end of the day, it's only us, right? We're having a bit of crack. We're learning as we go. Don't Turn worry. Around, November 6, 9 or 4, 7, Echo. November 6, 9 or 4, 7, Echo, Shining Ground. Pass message. Uh, November 6, 9, 4, 7, Echo would like to taxi from West Parking to General Aviation Parking. Shannon Ground, did you copy? November 6, 9 or 4, 7, Echo, Shannon Ground. You are clear to taxi to General Aviation via Alpha and hold short runway 6. Alpha to hold short runway 6. November 6, 9 or 4, 7, Echo. There's a guy throwing about a size 17 spanner into the works. <laughs> and I love it. <laughs> Colonel Fork, brilliant. So what we're going to what we're going to request from Colonel Fork, we're going to say, hey, we want you to power taxi on runway 06, exit at Charlie. Report when clear. So we'll we'll we'll, we'll we're role playing this one, lads, right? We're role playing this. Jesus. <laughs> brilliant. Why do I say hang on? What do I say when I want to taxi? Uh, can you put that in there so I can put it on notes? So Soul Sniper Games, if you got to download uh, the virtual ATC ground school, right? You got to download this document. It's in our Discord. And all you need to do is just have a read back. You'll see where it is. Stage one, stage two. The blue is what, sorry, the green is what the pilot says. Blue is what ATC says. Uh, and if you've any issue looking at colors. Ground, November 6, 9, 4, 7, Echo, Holy Chart, Runway 06, uh, Alpha. November 6, 9, 4, 7, Echo, you are cleared for a power taxi, Runway 06, exit at Charlie, and report when clear of the runway. Runway 06, power taxi to Charlie, report when on Charlie, November 6, 9, 4, 7, Echo. Nice. Now, at this stage, Tower would be saying, you cleared who? Right, it'd be a contact Tower. Tower would give them the instruction, and then they'd hand them back over to ground. But shh, don't worry about that now at the moment. Anyway, Soul Sniper Games, grab that document. It'll have all the information there for you. Rather than typing it out again, because I don't want to make a mistake. All the information is there. It's a PDF. You can just grab it, and uh, that'll do the thing for you. All right? And again, lads, don't worry about making a mistake. If you're sitting there thinking, Jesus, will I hop on for the crack? Just do it. What's, what's the worst that could happen? I'll make a mistake. Don't worry about it. I always make mistakes. Between Gibbo showing up at a friggin' Concord and Colonel Fork doing fast taxis. <laughs> right? Great bunch of lads. But anyway, we're doing well. We are doing well. You're doing great, lads. Super, super proud of you. That's what my little ATC book looks like. Look at this suffering state of it. 
You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Hey, Matty Lowe's is good to see you. It goes, dude. Dude, there's so many people after trying this for the first time. It's awesome. It's really, really good. It's I'm so proud of you. Only way to move in life is to make mistakes and learn. 100%, Durka. 100%. You can watch all the tutorials and yes, they help with the confidence. But the only real way you, you're going to get there is well, jump on. Don't worry if you make a mistake. You're going to learn. You know what I mean? And like, we can do this as often as you guys like. As I said, next week, we'll progress from stage four onwards. That'll be getting our takeoff clearance to whole shebang. Uh, and then the week after, we'll do the whole lot again. Yeah, ground, November 6, 9, 4, 7, Echo, clear, runway 06 on Charlie. November 6, 9, 4, 7, Echo, taxi via Charlie, Delta 2, Delta 1, across the apron, onto Alpha, and then onto the west apron. Uh, Shane Ground, we're looking for the regular general aviation parking this time. <laughs> Hang on! And uh, November 6, 9 or 4, 7 Echo, you passed the test. Uh, taxi via Charlie, Delta 2, Delta 1, and turn left onto the general aviation parking. Charlie, Delta 2, Delta 1, turn left, general aviation parking, November 6, 9 or 4, 7 Echo. And read back is correct. Brilliant. Shaffin and grind, Echo Tango, Bravo, Bravo. Tango, Bravo, Bravo, Shannon, Ground. Last message. Echo Tango, Bravo, Bravo, Cessna 172, GA parking information, India request via force circuits and engine start. Echo Tango, Bravo, Bravo, you are approved for via four circuits and engine start. Squawk via four, active runway is 06, QNH 1011, call for taxi. Prefer via four circuits and engine starts. Squawk via VFR. Active runway is 016. QNH 1011. Echo Tango. Bravo, bravo. Jeez, that was brilliant. Well done. That's Carter, I think. Get on ground. Golf Delta Delta. Bravo, bravo. Golf Delta Delta. Bravo, bravo. Shannon Ground. Pass message. Uh, holding permission. Uh... Holding position has forgot to get taxi permission. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo. That's okay. Continue taxi onto Alpha and hold short runway 06. Taxi via Alpha, hold short of runway 06. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo. Thank you. So, see the way you get like continue taxi or hold position that could happen so in fairness to david bay he went about his own business but we can actually use this as a great example david bay has taxied himself but he, he held position he's like uh-oh I, I shouldn't have done that but you might find other aircraft being told hold position caution other traffic or you know we've read through this already we're not getting too much into it tonight i don't want to overload the situation but for example if there was other aircraft in the vicinity if they can't see it, well, then I would tell them, you know, stop, hold position or follow the hawk on Alpha. You, you, you'll hear all of these things, uh, but for now, don't worry about it. We're doing all right. <laughs> Shannon, ground, Golf 249 Tango Mike. Golf 249 Tango Mike, Shannon, ground, pass message. Go 249 Tango Mike, Cessna 172, GA parking, information India, request IF, uh, VFR circuits and engine start. Golf 249er Tango Mike, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway is 06, QNH 1011, call for taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000. Active runway is 06. QNH 1011. Golf 249 Tango Mike. Uh, so, Gregory, if your ATIS is reading runway 24 and you have information Golf, 
don't worry about that. It's actually a good lesson. I have the sim set to custom weather, but sometimes Microsoft's uh, Microsoft's weather might be slightly behind uh, what you would see for uh, the likes of VATSIM. So don't worry about it too much. Uh, the Shannon Tower isn't actually modelled as a small Echo ground tower. Tango, bravo, bravo, GA parking, ready to taxi. Jesus. One second now, one second now. Right. Ooh. Press some buttons here. Echo, Tango, bravo, bravo, Shannon ground. Pass your message. Echo Tango Bravo Bravo is GA parking ready to taxi. Echo Tango Bravo Bravo taxi via the apron and Alpha hold short runway 06. Taxi via the apron and Alpha hold short runway 06. Echo Tango Bravo Bravo. Cool. I forgot to press the button, lads, but it's alright. We'll get over it. We'll get over it. Eamon, you're more than welcome, dude. You're more than welcome. Down and ground, Echo India, Julius, Indigo, Tango. Echo India, Juliet, India, Tango, Shannon Ground, pass message. Echo India, Juliet, India, Tango, outside West Air, request engine start for VFR circuits. And Echo India, Juliet, India, Tango, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway is 06, QNH 1011, offer taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start, QNH 1011, active runway 06, call you back for taxi, Echo India, Juliet India Tango. So smooth, so smooth. So see the way Epic kind of shouted on, I will call you back for taxi. It's okay Golf, to say Delta. that. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Holding short, runway 06 at Alpha. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. Ian Fisher, welcome in. How are you? Over to Tower on 118.7. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Good day. And just in case you're wondering, Epic Fool's call sign is indeed Egypt. <laughs> Echo India Juliet into uh, brilliant, right? Now, where did he say he was? Over at the West Jet, was it? <whistles> yeah, I can see him now. I can see him now. Jesus, lads, there's things happening. Uh, who is it? God Almighty, TGS just gifted five tier one subs. Thank you very, very much indeed, man. Jesus, thanks a million. Uh, is it only for VFR traffic? Yes. Does Shannon Ground need a chart? Yes! <laughs> Colonel Fork, yes! I'm looking for it! Um, but yeah, Soul Sniper Gamer, uh, this is just for VF4 at the moment. I'm about to drop me book again! Ah, oh, Jesus! I dropped me book! I've lost me page! All the information is gone! Golf 249 Tango Mike, GA parking, ready to taxi. That's a big 10 for good buddy. And uh, Golf 249 Tango Mike, taxi via the apron onto Alpha and hold short runway 06. Taxi via the That's apron, Alpha and hold short runway 06, Golf 249 Tango Mike. Zybok Doc is here, it's good to see you Zybok. Hello from Tipperary man. <laughs> IFR will come later, 100%, we'll, we'll, we will be doing IFR. One of the first IFR, well, one of the first VFR flights will fly from Shannon to Cork. Then we're going to do it under instrument flight rules. So there's many, many weeks of this course. And don't worry. If you guys feel that you're getting left behind or you've missed out on a something, don't worry. I'll always organize an additional stream. We can use Discord, you know, weekends, whatever. Don't worry. If you feel that we're moving ahead too fast, you gotta shout and say, Murph, I could really do it an extra, you know, hour on this. That's what I'm here for. Shout, right? Like, there's there's so much ground to cover here. The objective of this course is to get you comfortable, confident, and competent, right, to complete your own uh, flight using virtual ATC with a flight simulator. Now, to what extremes are we going to go? Let's just see how we go. 
the idea here is though we want you to be able to get connected to VATSIM and do your own flight and do so being comfortable and happy and just giving it a bash. Then you can extend it further. We can then focus on aircraft specific type ratings to do VATSIM flights. For example, Murph, I want to fly the 737 of VATSIM. Let's look at it. Let's work on a course or like a Monday night series that we can do with something like this. I want to fly the A320. Fine. You know, I want to fly in the US. There's some differences we need to work on. I mean, that's, that's all that's ahead of us. But for now, we're taking the baby steps to just break that worry, get rid of the mic fright and just give us enough information to get the ball rolling. You're going to learn all the skills, but like that's only about, you know, 20% of what's needed. 80% here is focused on your experience and practice, practice, Shannon practice. Ground, Echo India Juliet, India Tango, ready for taxi. And Echo India Juliet, India Tango, taxi via Echo, turn left onto Delta 1, Delta 2, via the apron, taxiway Alpha, and hold short runway 06. Shannon Ground, Echo India, Juliet India, Tango. Are you sure? No. Taxiway Echo, Hotel, turn left, Delta 1, Delta 2, across the apron, Alpha, and hold short runway 6. Okay. Um, can I go Echo 3, Hotel 1, Delta 1, Apron Alpha? Okay, I'm going to stop annoying you now and go back to work. No, no, you're grand. Echo 3, Hotel 1, Delta 1, The Apron, and Taxi Alpha. Ah, somebody found six. a chart. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> I was looking at the wrong chart. That's why I'm not a controller, lads. To be Echo fair. Echo Tango, Bravo, Bravo. Holding short runway 06 at Alpha. Bravo, bravo. Contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. Over the tower on 118.7. Echo Tango, bravo, bravo. Goodbye. What did you do tonight, Murph? I dropped my book seven times. <laughs> right? Do you know Shannon what I mean? Down. This is Hotel Kilo 2-3. Ready for round two. And Hotel Shannon Kilo... Down, and Hotel Kilo 2-3. Shannon Ground, pass message. Hotel Kilo 2-3 in a vision jet at GA Parking Information India requesting VFR circuits and engine start. Hotel Kilo 2-3, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway 06, Q&H 1011, call taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start, Squawk. VFR active runway is 06, QNH is 1011, uh, Hotel Kilo 23. Perfect. One epic, you devil. <laughs> Brilliant. You have to make me work, do you know? Now, there was another aircraft calling. Don't be afraid. Shannon ground, mic check. Uh, aircraft calling, uh, readability is 5. And Shannon Ground, Charlie Golf, Papa Bravo Papa. Uh, last aircraft calling, say again, call sign. Shannon Ground, Charlie Golf, Bravo Papa Bravo Papa. And Charlie Golf, Bravo Papa, Shannon Ground, pass message. Shannon Ground, Charlie Papa Bravo is... Uh, Complete with run-up information, India request taxi. Uh, Charlie Golf, Bravo, Papa, uh, current location? Shannon Ground, uh, Charlie Golf, Papa, Bravo, Papa, location is General Aviation. Type is CF-118. Charlie Golf, Bravo, Papa. 
Uh, you are a prude for VO4 circuits on engine start, squawk 7000, active runway 06, QNH 1011, call for taxi. I think that's right. Charlie Golf, Bravo, 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 1011, go for taxi. Okay, remember. Yeah. Okay, just remember, guys, read the script. Follow, Just follow that. Because if you, if you move Shining from... Ground it, Hotel Kilo 23 at General GA Parking, ready to taxi. And Hotel Kilo 23, taxi via the apron and Alpha, hold short runway 06. Taxiing via the apron and Alpha, hold short runway 06. Hello there. Uh, Hotel Kilo 23. Oh, can do is here. Welcome in, man. Good to see you. Welcome in, Raiders. I'm in a hoop. Doing ATC stuff. Well, we're, we're learning some ATC stuff. You have to start somewhere. Welcome in. Hope you had a great stream. How are we all keeping? Chin and ground. Irish 333. Three, three. We're in trouble now. Irish 333. Three, three, ground. Pass message. Irish 333 three is looking for clearance to taxi for departure to the east. Irish tree, 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 current location? Uh, we are at General Aviation Parking. Irish tree, tree, tree. Uh, departure to the east approved. Engine start approved. Squawk 7000. Active runway is 06. Q&H 1011. Call for taxi. Engine start and tax. Uh, engine start approved. Clearance approved. Taxi Squawk VFR This is payback <laughs> I know it's payback We'll try it again Iris Tree 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 is approved for East departure and engine start Squawk 7000 Active runway is 06 Q&H 1011 And call for taxi Departure to the east approved. Uh, Engine start approved. Call for taxi. Squawk VFR. And Iris Tree Tree Tree. He got it right. He's trying to trip me up. But he did it right. He did it right. Brilliant. Iris 333. Three, three. There you have it. Man, Colonel Fork. the yard. He threw me a curveball and I batted him back a spanner. <laughs> but it's, it's all about the learning. Don't worry if you make a mistake. That's what this is oh, all about. 249 Tango Mike, holding short runway 6 at Alpha. Golf 249 Tango Mike, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye bye. Over to Tower on 118.7. Tower Golf 249 Tango Mike. Goodbye. Really well done. Awesome stuff, lads. Considering two weeks ago was the first time we pushed the button to say, you know, Shannon Ground and your call sign. Now we're doing a bit of mess and you guys are hearing new things that's not even on the script. And I'm like an Egypt, you know, ah, Jesus. But don't worry about that. Stick to the script. Anyone who's just landed in here, good evening. Welcome in. We're doing an ATC course. It's, it's entry level. And we're taking it nice and slow because, well, there's a lot to learn when it comes to flying on a virtual network. Ramble on over to our Discord. Exclamation point Discord. That'll get you in. When you get to Discord... Pardon me. When you get to Discord, I'll show you now. No one call me on ATC for a minute, lads. I'm trying to explain stuff. One second, lads. When you get to Discord, you land on the arrivals page. Go up to start here. And then there's a... If you look down there, look. There's a shamrock. Click on the shamrock. That opens up the rest of the server. Then you go down to Pilot Ops. Pilot Ops, down here, click on the channel and find the ATC course. Each week, I'll update a new lesson of what we're doing and everything stays here. All the information and references, it all stays in there. All right? Shannon Ground, Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, Shannon Ground, pass your message.
Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo Type DA62 GA Parking Information India Request Taxi to Terminal Building at West Apron and Engine Start. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo and uh, restate your intention just so I'm clear. Uh, are you looking for startup or are you looking for a taxi to the apron? Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo request taxi to terminal building. Another curveball. And Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Uh, call me back when ready for taxi. Or maybe he is ready for taxi. I don't know. So we want a taxi from parking to the other Chain one. Chain ground, Irish 333, three, ready for taxi. Irish 333, taxi via the apron onto Alpha, hold short runway 06. Apron, Alpha, runway 06, hold short. Okay, cool. Irish 333. Right, I'm getting a little bit lost there with David Bay. We'll try him again. And uh, Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Don't be worried about it. It's it's this is Don't what will happen. Golf, Golf Delta Delta, Delta, Delta Bravo Bravo. Golf, Delta, please Delta. repeat. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo Shannon Tower. I uh, just want to be clear on what you're requesting. So you want to do an engine start and then taxi from General Aviation parking over to the apron. Is that correct? Shannon Ground, Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo. Yes, that's correct. Okay. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo. You are approved for engine start. Call back when ready to taxi. Hey, Clarence is here. This is Hotel Kilo 23. Holding short at 06. Uh, point Alpha. Hotel Kilo 23, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. Contacting at Tower at 118.7. Thank you. Tweet. So again, Two, right. Four engine starts. Golf Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Golf Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Read back correct. Thank you. So you'll hear different things. Sometimes a controller will make a mistake. If I'm ever going to be a controller in my life, I'm going to make mistakes. But... Don't worry about the phraseology. It, plain English, if you can work it that way. Like, what are you trying to do? Make your intentions clear. Don't worry if you're not following the script that well. Don't worry if you're saying or you can't get your brain to process the words. Put it in the most simplistic terms. I'm here. I want to go to there. You'll join the dots. More and more experience. That'll help you join the dots. I make it sound like everything's all well in the realm. But definitely starting off... Don't worry about it. Just as clear as mud. Hey, I'm over here and I want to get to over there. How do I do it? If you read down through the script, that's just showing you what way it's phrased and how you say it. But if you get a little bit jumbled up, stop, take take a moment, and then try it again. Shannon Ground, Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike. Shannon Ground, pass your message. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, Cessna 172, on stand 25 Bravo, looking to reposition to SARS hangar. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, Roger, uh, call when ready for pushback and start up. Uh, 
Uh, echoing the Charlie Papa Mike is nose in on stand two five Bravo, looking for a self maneuver off stand once started. Echo India, Charlie Papa Mike, Roger. We'll send uh, the ground crew with a tow and stand by for contact with the ground controller. I mean, all you can say is no. Irish 333 holding short, runway 06, head alpha. Six knots putting in a size 27 spanner into the works, by the way. Irish 333, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. Shannon Ground. One, one, eight. Irish 333, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. Echo. <laughs> Come on, six knots. You're great, Craig. He wants to self maneuver. Oh, what have he said? Self maneuver. Golf Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, GA parking, ready to taxi. Golf Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, taxi via the apron, Alpha, and turn left on West Apron for parking. Give a look at that. Look what they're doing. <laughs> Give a get in here and sort them out, will you? Taxi by the apron, Alpha, and turn left on West Apron for parking. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Read back is correct. Jeez. <laughs> right. <laughs> Jesus. Right, six knots. What are you asking me to do? Put me under pressure, but come on, we'll, we'll do it, man. We'll do it, come on. Jump on board for the big push. Shannon Ground, Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike. Echo, Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike. Shannon Ground, pass message. Unable to comply with a pushback, no tow bar, or a tow bar available. Looking to self-maneuver off stand. To taxi to Sarah's hangar. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, Roger. Report when ready to taxi. Startup is approved. Report when ready to taxi. Startup is approved. I don't know, am I right? For sure, listen, it worked. Ground a lozenge. What was that? Last aircraft calling, can you repeat? Someone needs to get Shannon Ground a lozenge. Someone needs to get Shannon Ground a pint? <laughs> or two. <laughs> Brilliant. Ah, Brilliant. Yeah, they're all keen to me. Where's Keen Lafford when you need him? Shannon Ground, Echo India, Mike Alpha Sierra. Echo India, Mike, Alpha Sierra, Shannon Ground, pass message. Echo India, Mike, Alpha Sierra is a Cessna 172 at GA Parking with Information India. Request VFR circuits and engine start. And Echo India, Mike, Alpha Sierra, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR. Active runway is 06 QNH 1011. Call for taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start, Squawk VFR, active runway is 06, QNH 1011, Echo India, Mike Alpha Sierra. Jeez, that was very good, wasn't it? That was very, very good. Echo, Echo, Juliet, India, Tango, requesting permission to read everything. Mad Keen, didn't take him long, lads, did it? Didn't take him long at all. Where's the button for Keen Lafford? The devil. Shannon Ground, Antonov 225 with Information India. Jesus. Antonov 225, Shannon Ground, Roger, please state Neither. intentions. Antonov 225, request engine start for IFR flight to Elitrum. <laughs> Antonov 225. You are approved for pushback and then engine start. Um, facing to the north, 
and report when ready to taxi. Approved pushback, then engine starts facing north, report ready for taxi, and north 225. Jesus, the people of Leitrim will never be the same again! Huh? Jesus, he might be fibbing. Who's fibbing? To be fair, he did say he never gets red-faced. I didn't get red-faced! <laughs> I want to self-maneuver. Oh, behave. Right! Is that, what, is that what you use as a chat line? Cannon ground. November Kilo Romeo 5-4. I think I got this right. Uh, November Kilo Romeo 5-4. Shining ground. Pass message. November Kilo Romeo 5-4. A uh, DHC-4. Request VFR circuits and engine start. November Kilo Romeo 5-4, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway 06, QNH 1011, call for taxi. Ah, Jerry Coogan, good to see you, Jerry. What's happening? Murph is like fruit ninja with traffic. <laughs> Brilliant. Hello there. Hello there. Shannon Ground, Echo India, Alpha, Bravo, Charlie. Shannon Ground, Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike. Echo India, Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, Shannon Ground, pass message. Echo India, Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, SR22G. Parking information Bravo request VFR circuits and engine start. Echo India Alpha Bravo Charlie, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway 06, QNH 1011, call for taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000. Squawk VFR, active runway 0621011, Echo in gear, Alpha, Bravo, Charlie. Ah, that's brilliant. Brilliant, well done. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, Shannon, ground, pass message. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, um, looking for taxi to the SARS hangar. Uh, Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, Roger. Taxi via the apron, Delta 2, Delta 1, right turn onto the SARS hangar. Shannon Ground, Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo Shannon Ground stand by Echo India Charlie Papa Mike confirm last message uh, for taxi <laughs> It's getting busy now isn't it Does he mean the SARS hangar as in like search and rescue Echo India Charlie Papa Mike confirm uh, Delta 2 Delta 1 SARS hangar and not Delta 1 Delta 2 SARS hangar Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, Delta 2, Delta 1, onto the SARS hangar. I need to look at me charts, lads. Hang on. Where's the f... Okay. No, wait, come back, you're great, Craig. Um, <clears throat> Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, taxi via the apron, Delta 1, Delta 2... Onto the SAR hangar. Jays, I think I'm right. I hope I'm right. Taxi via Delta 1, Delta 2, onto the SARS hangar. And can you confirm I'm okay to self maneuver? Self maneuver is approved. Caution Antonov AN225 on the ramp, followed by Airbus A320, followed by DHC Caribou. Caution of other traffic. Self-maneuver approved. <laughs> <laughs> right.
Report them inside. Report them out your window. I'm about to drop me book. Brown, Echo, India, Yankee, Golf, Charlie. It's a busy night here in Shannon. Hello there. Echo, India, Yankee, Golf, Charlie, Shannon, Ground, Osmast. Echo, India, Yankee, Golf, Charlie, Cessna, 152. GA bargain information in there. Request VFI circuits and engine start. Echo India Yankee Golf Charlie, you are approved for VF4 circuits and engine start. Squawk VF4, active runway is 06, QNH 1011, call for taxi. Approved for VFI circuits and engine start. Squawk VFR, active runway is 06, QNH 1011, Echo India Yankee Golf Charlie. Echo India, Mike Alpha Sierra, GA Parkin, ready to taxi. Echo India, Mike Alpha Sierra, Roger. Taxi via the apron, Alpha, hold short, runway 06. Caution, Cessna 172 in, on the uh, apron, report them in sight. Taxi via the apron, Alpha, and hold short, runway 06. Echo India, Mike Alpha Sierra. And Echo India, Mike Alpha Sierra. Readback is correct. Just caution of other traffic on the apron. A Cessna 172, just to report them in sight. Roger, report Cessna 172 in sight. Echo India, and Alpha, Mike Alpha Sierra. What did Six Shannon not say he was in? Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Shannon Ground, pass message. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, Western Apron Terminal, ready to taxi. And Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, Roger, can you state your intention? Are you looking for circuits or a departure? Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, DA62, West Apron, Information India. Engines running, request VFR circuits. Golf, Delta Delta Bravo Bravo, you are approved via four circuits. Uh, taxi is also approved. Taxi via Alpha, hold short, runway 06. Approved for VFR circuits and taxi via Alpha. Squawk VFR, active runway is 06. Golf, Delta Delta Bravo Bravo. We kind of recycled it. We're there, though. We're there. I think Murphy needs a sip. Shannon Ground, Irish 333. Irish 333, Shannon Ground, pass your message. Irish 333, requesting flyby. Irish 333, negative. The pattern is full. I'm only joking. Go on for the crack, sir. <laughs> flyby approved, Irish 333. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, baby! <laughs> Shannon Ground, Antonov 225, ready for taxi. Antonov 225, roger, taxi via Alpha, caution, other aircraft holding short, report, holding short of runway 06. Taxi via Alpha to runway 06, hold short 06 and caution, other aircraft, Antonov 225. All stations, all stations, this is Shannon Ground, caution. Antonov 225, now taxiing. Caution, wake turbulence. Window shattering. Arse numbing, shaking of everything. Take it fierce handy. <laughs> Did you see the new airport add on for Orbex? Hotel Kilo 23, holding short at Charlie, requesting taxi to GA parking. Hotel Kilo 23, Shannon Ground. Taxi via uh, Charlie, Delta 2, Delta 1. Left turn onto General Aviation Parking. There goes Colonel Fork, look. <laughs> Taxi via Charlie to Delta 2, then Delta 1, and turn left to GA Parking, Hotel Kilo 2-3. I'll uh, keep my cheeks clenched for the end. Hotel Kilo 2-3, Roger, read back correct. Godspeed. <laughs> <laughs> Echo India. Alpha Bob, Void Charlie, West Apron, ready to taxi. Echo 
India Yankee Golf Charlie, Taxi via the Apron, Alpha, and Hold Short Runway 06. Metro India Alpha Bravo Charlie ta Taxi via the Apron, Alpha, and Hold Short Runway 06. Echo India Alpha Bravo Charlie. Ah, oh, that's brilliant, isn't it? Your heart would warm, so it would. Uh, it is brilliant, though. That's brilliant. India, Yankee Golf, Charlie, GA parking, ready for taxi. <laughs> Echo India, Yankee Golf, Charlie, taxi via the apron, Alpha, hold short, runway 06. Via April Alpha Hold Short Runway 06 Echo India Yankee Golf Charlie. I made a terrible mistake. I gave your man the wrong call sign, but don't tell anyone else. It's only you and me that noticed it. Right. It's grand. It's totally fine, lads. Say nothing to no one, right? I was too busy eating the dirt back there. Wait, what? Shannon Ground. November Kilo Road. Shannon Romeo Tower, Park. Echo India Charlie, Papa Mike. Request for taxi. November Kilo Romeo 54 Shannon Ground Taxi via the apron Alpha Hold short Runway 06 Kilo 54 uh, Taxi on uh, Apron Alpha And hold short Runway 06 Echo India Charlie Papa Mike Shannon Ground Send message Shannon Ground, uh, could I have emergency services to stand 25 Bravo? Unfortunately, I've hit the marshaller while trying to self maneuver off stand. A poor devil. Uh, Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, Roger, ground services have been dispatched to your location and uh, report back to Shannon Ground if any further assistance is required. <laughs> Jesus. He hit the, the marshaller. Robin. The master name was Robin. Was Robin. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Golf it was the Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, holding short, runway 06 at Alpha with what seems like an earthquake behind me. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Contact tower on 118.7. Over to tower on 118.7, Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, get me out of here. <laughs> Jesus, though. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike. Oh, yes. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Sorry, Mike, shining ground, send message. Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, if you could um, ask the chaplain to attend the stand as well, please. <laughs> Echo India, Charlie, Papa, Mike, Roger, or Roger, Roger, Father Ted has been dispatched, uh, await arrival immediately of the uh, arrival of the chaplain. <laughs> the poor old devil didn't make it, lads. Thank you very much. <laughs> That's at least two decades of the rosary now. <laughs> Jesus. Shannon Ground, Antonov 225, holding short runway 06, ready for departure. Antonov 225, Shannon Ground, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye bye. 118.7, go away, Antonov 227. Jesus. The size of that thing taken off, he'll have to back taxi and everything. If they act up, Merv, just tell them to confirm tail number that you have a phone number. Absolutely. Six knots, rest in pieces. What happened to him? He ran over the marshaller. For God's sake, you can't be doing things like that. Jesus. That friggin' Antonoff is holding up the whole show. Golf 249, Tango Mike. And Golf 249, Tango Mike. Shannon Tower, pass your message. 
Go oh, 249 Tango Mike, Cessna 172, GA parking, information India, request VFR circuits and engine start. Golf 249 Tango Mike, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway 06, QNH 1011, call for taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start, Squawk 7000, active runway 06, QNH 1011, Golf 249 Tango Mike. I dropped me book! Echo India, make Alpha Sierra, holding short, runway 06 at Alpha. Jeez. Echo India, Mike Alpha Sierra, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye bye. Over the tower on 118.7. Echo India, Mike Alpha Sierra, good night. And then ground, Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo, Shannon Ground, pass message. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo at Taxiway C, aborted takeoff, medical emergency, request taxi back to General Aviation Parking. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo, Roger, fast taxi approved. Charlie, Delta 2, Delta 1, left onto General Aviation Parking. Fast taxi approved. Charlie, Delta 2, Delta 1, left to General Aviation Parking. Golf, Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo, thank you. That Antonov seemed to have an issue Golf as well. 249 Tango Mike, GA parking, ready to taxi. Golf 249 Tango Mike, taxi via the apron, Alpha, hold short, runway 06. Taxi via the apron, Alpha, and hold short, runway 06, Golf 249 Tango Mike. Shannon Ground, Hotel Kilo 2-3. Hotel Kilo 2-3, Shannon Ground, pass message. Hotel Kilo 2-3 in a vision jet at GA Parking Information India requesting VFR circuits and engine start. Hotel Kilo 2-3, you are approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway 06, QNH 1011, offer taxi. Approved for VFR circuits and engine start. Squawk 7000, active runway is 06, QNH 1011, Hotel Kilo 23. We're getting there, we're getting there. Shannon Ground, Antonov 225 is with you on Delta 2 after rejected takeoff. Co pilots had stew as a mid flight meal. Rejecting uh, flight with them will be returning to the gates. And Antonov 225 also with you. Uh, hold position. I will call you back. <laughs> now, Wilco, we'll Antonov 225. That's what you get for eating stew. Keep him there till tomorrow. We take to the skies next week, Ibo. That's the hope. With you. With you. What do you mean, with you? Where's Red Baron going? Red Baron. Hotel Kilo 23. Ready to taxi at GA Parking. Hotel Kilo 23, taxi v the apron, Alpha, hold short, runway 06. Taxi via the apron, Alpha, hold short, runway 06, Hotel Kilo 23. I am with you. I am, no, I am with you forever, he says. Do I ask take off at the ground? Shannon Ground, Irish 333. Three, three. Irish 333, three, three, stand by. Um, so, Soul Sniper Games, you need to report back to the ground so you report to shannon ground when you're at the hold short for runway six they'll give you the next instruction iris tree 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 shannon ground pass message shannon ground iris tree 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 looking for a taxi to general aviation parking we iris tree at 
uh, taxiway Charlie short of runway 24. Irish tree tree tree. Taxi via Charlie Delta 2 Delta 1 left onto general aviation parking. Charlie Delta 2 Delta 1 left on the ramp. Disco Stew is with you. Yeah, I don't know. Where did that creep in? You know what I mean? With you as part of that. Echo India Alpha Bravo. Charlie Hong short runway 06 at Alpha. Echo India Alpha Bravo Charlie. Contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye bye. Over to Tower on 118.700. Echo India Alpha Bravo Charlie. Lads, can we get. A round of applause for Echo India Alpha Bravo Charlie. That's amazing. Wasn't he very good? Jesus, he was brilliant. Well done, that man. Brilliant. There's hope for us yet. Will you give me some lessons? I can do us some lessons. <laughs> that was really well done. That was fantastic. Soul. Was it? Soul Sniper Games. There's no tower yet. Yeah, don't worry about it. We've no tower, so just blast off out of there. You head on up the road. Soul Sniper Games. Dude, well done. That was excellent. Really, really well done. So don't worry. We don't have tower for you can see. You just bait on. You just, you can take off or whatever it is. Uh, I'm Michael Plays. We can see you there. Look, there is Michael Plays. Well done, that man. Very, very good. Well done, dude. That was awesome. Legend, absolutely. <laughs> That's okay, don't worry about Hotel it. Hotel Kilo 23, holding short runway 06. Hotel Kilo 23, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye. -bye. Hotel Kilo 23, contacting Tower at 118.7. Have a good day. I just confirm Hotel Kilo 23, Tower 118.7. One one eight point seven. Thank you. Ah, Gibbo, you absolute legend. You absolute legend. Thank you very, very much indeed, Gibbo. Awesome, dude. Awesome. Mayday, Mayday, Mayday. Shannon Ground, Antonov two two five. All six of our engines have exploded. We're evacuating onto the taxiway. This is a real world message. Navayan two two five. Shannon Ground. Roger. Run away. Run fast. Wilco. <laughs> what else can you say? Lake Tahoe Ground, this is November. Oh, on frequency. <laughs> Jesus. Between six knots killed a guy, six knots killed a guy, and then we had an Antonov with a display. Jesus, Delta ground, Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo, requesting emergency services at General Aviation Parking. Delta Delta Bravo Bravo, please state the nature of this medical emergency. Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo, co-pilot deceased. Oh Jesus! Jesus! Right, uh, <clears throat> uh, Golf Delta Delta Bravo Bravo, uh, we will dispatch medical uh, emergency services to your location. Jesus, that was a bit kind of... Delta, Delta, Bravo, Bravo. Many thanks, although not an emergency anymore. No, probably not. Jesus, that was a bit morbid. Anyway, right, lads, we need to kind of pull a stop to this because I'm going to be here till tomorrow. And look at the time! Echo India, Yankee Golf, Charlie, holding shot of runway 06 at Alpha. Echo India, Yankee Golf, Charlie, contact Shannon Tower on 118.7. Bye-bye. On one one eight decimal seven, Echo India, Yankee Gold, Charlie, bye bye. Okay, so what we'll do, any aircraft currently waiting to hold short, we'll continue on with you. But anyone else, we'll call it a night there, guys. Uh, so the next, I think there's two or three, I think, just waiting to queue up. 
Did you enjoy what we're doing Cannon tonight? Ground. MKR 5 4 holding short runway 6. November Kilo Romeo 5 4, contact Shannon Tower 118 decimal 7. Bye bye. NKR54118 decimal 7. Thank you. Six knots is away. Six knots killed the guy. <laughs> uh, you, you've all done an excellent, excellent job. Like it can't be it can't be like said enough. You guys really have, and yeah, there's a bit of crack, there's a bit of fun. You can't do this sort of stuff on the network. That's what makes it a lot of fun for us, right? Between friggin' Antonov's exploding um, you know engines colonel forks doing flybys six knots killed a guy right poor old david bay had a friggin something awful happened to him uh it's it's a bit of crack as well but the whole point is we're trying to learn we're trying to get the lingo Ooh. and echo india yankee golf charlie just to be aware you have a hot mic and we're all sorted now again. Uh, but anyway, the whole point of this, we're to get used to it. This is stage one to four. We can repeat this if you guys want, or we can move on to the next stage, which would be next week. That's going to pretty much get us up to taking off, departing, and then let's see what happens. It's going to be very difficult. I don't have radar, but a massive, massive thanks to Epic Fool tonight uh, because he was able to staff up another tower. It just gave everyone the chance to kind of break out onto different uh, servers and we might have to do the same next week. Now, it, it's, not in, it's not an impossible task. You guys just need to bear with us in terms of, well, don't pass anybody, okay? Uh, if there's someone ahead of you and they're moving slow, keep your distance. Give them a bit of a chance. You know what I mean? But we're getting there together, you know. Uh, it could be fun to do this weekly outside of the streams. Yeah, 100%. 249 Tango Mike, holding short runway 06 at Alpha. Golf 249 Tango Mike, contact Shannon Tower, 118.7. Bye-bye. Over to Tower on 118.7. Golf 249 Tango Mike. Good night. Cool. Brilliant. Um... But yeah, that, that's the idea, lads. That's what we're going to try and do. So if you feel that we're moving too fast forward or too far ahead, we'll just shout in the Discord saying, Murph, you know, can we do this again or can I look over this again? I'm happy to help out anytime I can. Um, and as I said, next week, we're going to focus on stages four, five and six, probably. And then the week after, we'll do the whole lot again. And if it means we can repeat each stage, grand. The reason why I'm heavily focusing on this particular exercise it's because it uses every single function that you're going to get in terms of your startup, your taxiing, circuits, which are going to help your flying skills, and then eventually landings, all right? They're the things, if you can polish the skills on those, but well, the rest of it, it's a little bit easier to work ahead. Once you get into like on routes and non-normals and all this mad stuff that will follow later on, this is the basic area. This is like elementary school of, of honing in on your skills and you guys have done such an amazing job tonight i can't get over how many people actually did shannon ground hotel kilo t3 now holding short at runway 06 i realized i called a little too early when i was still online hotel kilo 23 that's quite okay contact shannon tower 118 decimal seven contact tower 118.7 thank you have a great day we'll see you um, but yeah, uh, as I said earlier, a little crack to break the ice can make it feel more accessible. A hundred percent. It could be fun to do this. Yeah, Colonel Fork, a hundred percent. Lads, you need to have a bit of crack with this. Do you know what I mean? I mean, it, it's hard enough to learn something new. It's very hard to learn something new. So like, you need to have a bit of fun, a bit of crack, and you know what I mean. So I think we've two more guys just waiting to call up. One anyway. And then we'll see what the crack is. But be sure to head over to the Discord. Have a look at that um, document, the ground school, and read over it. If you read down through it, you're going to pick up stuff. You know what I mean? And everything is scripted there as well. You know. Uh, if anything, it uh, 
he loves him uh, relax and soak in the information. Yeah. Epic was great with that. Greeting everyone and some bants before getting into it. Ah, Rambog, that's great. Yeah, Ep Epic Fool, he's deadly. Epic Fool Hello is there. gas. Hello there. Uh, Thrasher, welcome in. Epic Fool regularly flies on Vatsim in helos in a chopper, and there's not many people who fly in Vatsim in helicopters, especially over Ireland. Especially. And Epic Fool has developed tons of helipad scenery for Ireland as well. I mean, the chap has a, he's, he's a lot of stuff going on. But uh, no, a huge thanks there to, uh, to Epic there for tonight for jumping on. He knows the airport anyway. But it's all about learning this in an environment that we know it's safe. It's only us, lads. You know what I mean? It's only us. So we can learn the basics here. And when we're happy and when we're comfortable, well, sure, then we'll go out to a VAT sim or we'll get onto a controller. And, you know, a, a big shout out to VAT Air. V-A-T-E-I-R. VAT Air. Right? It's the Irish version of VAT sim. It's if Irish controllers with Irish airspace. They are very aware of what we are doing. They've helped me with this phraseology. And once we're ready to start doing some stuff, they're going to be ready to start staffing up control towers in Ireland uh, to help us out. Like, it's it's huge. It's great. It's really, really great, you know. So, uh, right, I think that's it. I think we're all we're all clear to high. Lads, I'm off to me Labba. The Irish division on Vatsim. That's the one Epic film. That's the one. Epic, dude, thank you very, very much indeed for all your help tonight. You legend. And, uh, right, lads, that's it. We're going to leave it there. I can't believe we got so many people involved with flying tonight. That is absolutely incredible. Just to give you an idea. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. And I think Epic had about 7 or 8. More than 30 pilots have tried this tonight. Uh, I'm immensely proud of you guys. Absolute great effort. And uh, sure, we'll bash it through it again soon. Do you know what I mean? Uh, but yeah, we're all in this together. 100% Gibbo. Couldn't have said it better myself. We're all in this together. And that's what we're looking for. Uh, and 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 Gibbo, he'd be the, the, you know, he'd be quiet there in the background. But it's huge thanks to Gibbo for this idea. This is a Gibbo idea. That'll just tell you, right? That'll tell you. Do you know what I mean? Gibbo said, Murph, do you know what would be handy? I says, what? He says, if you do to if you do something with ATC. And I says, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Uh, and then that was it. Uh, seed was planted. Uh, so anyway, right. I'm finished now with ATC, lads. I'll be well, have a look in the Discord channels. And again, here's something for you. If someone wants to try to be at uh, the ground frequency like I did tonight, don't forget I'm reading off the same script. The only thing that I have to change is your call sign. That's all I got to do. All, it's, it's actually easier doing ATC. Okay? All the channels are still live on our Discord. So by all means, if anyone wants to jump on there during the week, ask your friend, ask your buddy, or just ask anyone, hey, can you jump on? Would you mind being the tower? I want to practice this. And then swap over the roles. I mean, why not, right? I mean, that's it's our Discord channel. We can freaking do what we like with it, right? So that, that's what we want to do. So that's all there for you, right? Uh, you need the charts too. Good man yourself, Colonel Fork. You absolutely need the charts too. But there is charts here in the document, uh, the ground school document. I just didn't look at them. <laughs> I need a brandy now. David Bay, you did brilliant. Well done. Well done. Uh, yeah, we could do something like that, Colonel Fork. Yeah, we could do. So the charts, everything is in this uh, ground school manual and that's in our Discord. Go into the ATC course and you shall see it. Va. All right. So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, thank you all so very, very much for your help tonight. It's been absolutely incredible watching you guys do the stuff. I'm so proud. I, I can't get over how many... <laughs> Sweet llamas suffering. Jesus. Maddie Lowe's is ups to down, look. Um, <laughs> and poor old six knots killed the guy. Um, I can't get over how many and how advanced you guys were doing this stuff. It's... Awesome. So well, well done. So until Wednesday, when we bring you the news, enjoy your week and we'll see you soon. Good night.